testing, one, two, three. Okay, seems we're live. Um, yesterday we finished the uh, the stream after our failed war versus the Mamluks. Well, almost. It was close, but yeah. Uh, my bandwidth uh, once again was completely gone, uh, so I uh, continued the game after my opponent yesterday. And I'll bring you up to date with a couple of screenshots. Uh, basically, because I attacked the Mamluks uh, and then got myself a short truce, I was able to uh, declare on the Mamluks again with the help of the Ottomans, because the Ottomans, their truce ended longer, uh, well, I mean, later than my truce, so I could call them in the day their, uh, their truce ended with the uh, promise of land. So yeah, as you can see, um, something shifted in the alliance pattern in, uh, in North Africa. Plemkin uh, actually rivaled Morocco. And uh, the Ottomans dissolved their alliance with the uh, Plemkin guys. Wouldn't have mattered because uh, by doing this, even if Plemkin was allied to the Ottomans, they would have uh, been against Plemkin anyway. So, but yeah, it shifted around. So I called in Morocco with uh, favors and then uh, the Ottomans with the province of land. And these were the numbers at the start of the war. Doesn't look that bad, but yeah. Thing is, uh, the Ottomans have to approach from the north. And while well, yeah, the Mamluks could stomp me blind uh, from the by going straight west. So yeah, what I basically did was um, move all my troops on top of the fort in uh, north on Alexandria, basically. While the Mamluks and everybody else in the war dogpiled Morocco, they weren't happy about it, I guess, but I don't care. They were just a divergent. As soon as uh, Cairo fell, or uh, yeah, it's called Cairo in game, isn't it? Well, as soon as Cairo fell, the Ottomans were also able to uh, travel into my land. And then, well, yeah, before uh, they could engage anybody, the Mamluks went bankrupt. That's basically because I uh, forced them to loan up in the war before. And yeah, the Mamluks went bankrupt. So that was good news. Uh, during this entire war and and uh, even uh, just after the, I allied the Ottomans, they started subsidizing me. So I paid off all my loans with the subsidies and only made an army right before this war. So all in all, it was well. I didn't do a single battle in this war. I didn't do anything. Only, the only thing I did was uh, siege up one fort. That was it. The Ottomans did the rest of the work. So yeah, and it's all very predictable after that. Uh, it's all very predictable after that. Yeah, they got they got wiped into the ground. They were basically trapped inside Morocco and everybody got wiped over there. The Mamluks went bankrupt, so their troops had no morale whatsoever. And yeah, Tlemkin got wiped also. So yeah, basically I did um, a separate piece with Tlemkin. And uh, well, with all the claims that I had and with all the claims Morocco had, we were able to divide entire Tlemkin between the both of us. So two provinces, two claims went to Morocco and I just full annexed the rest. But yeah, and then I started coring it while, well, yeah. Right after I asked uh, military access from uh, Kara, and that triggered the Ottomans to go after these guys, Najd and Shamar. And well, yeah, they got full uh, occupied also. They got peace out with a lot alliance. And Shamar actually became my vassal. I, need, I wanted to expand into Arabia. And then it was time for a really bold move. But bear with me, this is a tactic that I used before. I just waited and waited and waited. I couldn't care for a call for peace. I just waited until the Ottomans had enough of the war. 
And they made their own separate peace and they asked for this land and revoked all the cores. So yeah, this dropped the uh, warper, this uh, dropped the war score, but it wasn't really necessary to siege up all this, but yeah, I just wanted to prevent them to uh, make more troops, so I placed troops on all their forts, on all their provinces again, and uh, yeah, because the Ottomans made a separate peace, I didn't have to give them land anymore in the war, so I could take 100% peace deal in the war without actually giving the Ottomans anything. That's actually the best idea really. If you ask, uh, if you do uh, ask a big nation with the promise of land, just sit on them and wait on, until they peace out. It's not easy to judge, but yeah, as soon as you see your ally going medium war exhaustion, he will peace out. And then basically you place uh, 1k on every province your ally occupied. And as soon as he occupies the ally you promised land, uh, as soon as he pieces out about it, you just place every 1k on each province and just siege it all back. You don't even need to siege the forts because you've got like, you can do a 100% peace deal. You can uh, siege it up just to get lower war province cost, but yeah. That's not really necessary. And then, uh, bear with me, this is also uh, a bit of a gutsy move, but I did it before. Game of troll the Ottomans and uh, blocked them off from uh, getting anything else in uh, in, Alexand in uh, Egypt, basically. So they cannot even claim the Mamluks anymore unless they get like Crete from Venice. Yeah, I got conquest of Jerusalem and Mamluks, yeah, they lost Alexandria and basically a lot of their coastline and a couple of forts and blah blah. Now you will say, wait, what? But what What of the Ottomans? They broke alliance with you then. Nah, they don't. You can avoid it. You can avoid it, but you must know how, really. See? Uh, there is a once your province modifier. For the claims, they had claims on this land, basically all, all these uh, these lands. But yeah, if you manage to uh, keep your opinion higher than 100, then uh, they won't go hostile over the claims, even if you if even if they have a military uh, advisor, they simply won't. It's risky business doing this because the once your province modifier is uh, is a bit unpredictable. But if you max out the relations like I did, improve the relations plus 100, and an alliance, and offer uh, offer access and whatnot, you can usually get above 100 relations with a gift, which I did. I could have given them a, a, an even bigger gift uh, for plus 25, but I was counting on the once your provinces is uh, not that big. Especially because the Ottomans were busy in another war. Usually, and this is a thing that uh, not a lot of people know, usually an ally will shift out their vital, uh, their vital, uh, what's it called, their vital territory once you get a core on this land. So basically what I did was just start a core here or there or anywhere and as soon as that finishes, he shifts out the vital interest. Well, I'm not sure that is how it works, but I've seen it, I've did it like this a couple of times already, and they just shifted their, uh, it might also be, for example, you have to wait until next year, or this and that, but I've seen it in my Hyder campaign also, the moment you core something that is, uh, that, is uh, their, that they flagged as vital territory, they will reconsider their options. So yeah, they didn't flag all this land as vital territory anymore. They just flagged this land, their claims basically, as a strategic utility. And they just uh, put their vital uh, vital territories somewhere else. Mind you, this still is risky biscuits because uh, if the uh, once your provinces is uh, bigger than you can gift them and uh, you can improve relations, they will break alliance. They will break alliance. <laughs> they will do it. So yeah, uh, but I I was really confident, especially because they didn't have a militarist ruler. They had an, administ an administrative guy. 
If it was a militarist in the Ottomans, I wouldn't have done it. Oh, man. I hate people who call without uh, sending their own numbers. Usually salesmen, so never mind. I'll just let it do its own thing. So yeah, basically, I took this. I blocked the Ottomans off from going into Hedjars, going and, uh, into this. And, uh, well... They even killed my rebels <laughs> because I bordered the Mamluks, I gave them access, and they even, they even killed my own rebels because they they really like me a lot. And I was also planning ahead, so yeah. It's all going swell, uh, but I was sitting on like 20 war exhaustion by then, so I needed a breeder. And, uh, yeah, well, I paid it off a little to avoid peasants in Tunis, in my capital and all, and then some events spawned, and uh, whatnot. So I'm at two pl plus two stability. And basically, this is now where I am. This was, uh, this is basically where I am now. This was like, yeah, just now. I'll, I'll continue from this situation in a minute. So, Cyprus was, is still independent. They were uh, guaranteed by the Mamluks still. So now it is possible to promise uh, the Ottomans Cyprus and make Mamluks go belligerent because their truce was up. And uh, Mamluks is now allied to Hejaz and to Morocco. So I can use uh, the Ottomans to force uh, Ottomans and Hejaz and whatever. I'll just use them as a as an attack dog basically and this is like yeah this is what i'll do right now so uh i i guess i'll switch back to my game uh the stupid bandwidth in belgium don't love i got a bandwidth limit of like uh i don't know 150 gigabytes and it gets reset nine in the morning my time on uh <laughs> on the first of february so i could only start streaming now my band it was completely up. Uh, sorry, or you missed all that, but you really, you really didn't miss a lot with the war versus the Mamluks. You really didn't miss a lot. I didn't do any battle. So yeah, basically the the last couple of years was like um, the last couple of years. Oh, yeah. Let's see. If I'm set up right here, just give me a minute. I gotta re-enable the right uh, windows. Oh, yeah. I didn't enable chat, so sorry for I didn't respond to your comments. So yeah, before we start this war, uh, I'll give a quick update. So yeah, and Morocco didn't mind. No, they didn't mind because I called them in with favors. I call them in with favors, and I give them gave them land in the in the Tlemcen peace deal, so they were happy. The thing is that they, they broke alliance because yeah, they lost Tlemcen as an uh, as a rival partner, and if the uh, if the if the AI has to choose a new rival, and if their only possible rival is their ally, they will break alliance and rival you. So that is what happened basically. Morocco rivaled me just because they said, "Yeah, I don't got, I don't got anybody else to rival but you and Portugal." See, they don't have anybody else. Otherwise, they would, you would have seen uh, three here. So yeah, basically now I can use the the Ottomans versus Morocco, Hejaz, and the uh, the other guys. So uh, I want to check first if I flagged. Oh, I didn't flag Hejaz as a rival yet. Huh. Thought I did. Well. Bam. Then we go. Wait, what? Huh. I'm pretty sure that Hejaz rivaled me. Why can I not? Oh, I, they didn't? Huh. Why can I not rival Hejaz? Are they too big then? Oh, well, I'll just keep the slot open after this peace deal. I will likely get another uh, rival slot. God knows we would even uh, be able to uh, rival Castile. So, did the chat say anything else? Barbecue for the win. Oh, hello there. Gonna separate peace out Mamluks and just give them Cyprus. Yep, 
that's the plan. You guessed me right, uh, Bob Gifu. I, I do this stuff a lot. It's just opportunistic move. Opportunistic moves and checking what is possible with la promising land and all. So I made a, uh, all the claims I could, really. Well, did I? Oh, I'm not gonna wait to make another claim. Uh, hi, Tom. Feel your pain the same here. Oh, yeah. I, I don't know what, why you said that. Probably to something I said. Do you know if GPS... What is GPS? Will help you view other G oh, greater powers in throne claims now. Uh, do you know if greater powers will help you view other GPS in throne claims now? I don't get the question, sorry. I suppose you could uh, annul alliance of possible targets. You're gonna do a force. Uh, you're gonna do a force PU war on, and you can say, "Yeah, break your uh, break your alliance with uh, force PU target." But uh, influence nation, I don't think that has any effect on. Uh, no, I don't see it has any effect on on uh, on the Game of Thrones. But yeah, you could use the consort mechanic also and blah blah, but greater power actions, I'm not sure. Throne claim wars. Yeah, well, you could annul alliance of your throne claim target. Oh, it used to be that great powers would not join you in a throne claim war if you are targeting another great power. Uh, yeah. I still think that's the case. Basically, if you do a force PU war, you you are on your own. They were your ally. You can't ask France to force PU the Commonwealth uh, as Austria, for example. They won't help. I'm pretty. I, I don't think the uh, if you influence France or something, you can't even do it because the, nah, I, I I don't see it. It's worth theory crafting over, but I don't see how the greater power mechanics can help you in a force PU war. Except from annulling alliances from the... Co if you say, let's say, attack the Commonwealth and they are allied to Bohemia, you can ask Bohemia to annul their alliance with blah blah blah. But you know all that. Yeah, console test ahead if you want. So yeah, Tannis. Uh, what happened the last couple of years? We developed uh, Tannis to spawn the Renaissance there. And I just embraced it. I just embraced it. To go for, uh, and uh, I saved up all my military points to go to Tech 9. I am paying off my, uh, I'm paying off my uh, corruption. I'm hoping that the Ottomans will subsidize me again once I declare war and uh, their uh, rival is involved and whatnot. If not, I will just lower this a bit. But I got a nice ducat pool. So, uh, I, you don't see me complaining. Our income is, yeah, it's not that bad. And I, I think my corruption went down from like 45 to 35 already just by paying it off. The autonomy is, uh, is low everywhere. I don't have a single fort. I don't care. I can just go uh, all the uh, autonomy again. So yeah, this is what I, this is, you see, Tlemkin is gone. Bye bye. Algiers is also gone because they were allied to Morocco only and Morocco was involved in the war versus the Mamluks so I could declare on uh, Algiers with impunity. So basically, yeah. The idea now is to unite <laughs> North Africa under my rule. Yeah, Morocco won't... I won't be able to uh, annex anything but I can annul their alliance with the, uh, with the Ottomans. I can do it. And then uh, come knocking again. Or uh, wait until Portugal declares on them or something. So yeah, anything else. I still, I still got a balance stack. I probably should uh, start improving this. Uh, yeah, well, but a balance stack will be really unbalanced soon. How much am I getting now? Oh well. So I took uh, administrative ideas as first group because yeah, if you, if I'm gonna core Cairo with its uh, 40 development, uh, I don't want to know what it costs without uh, 
administrative. Uh, administrative uh, is not only for the coring cost. It, it'll uh, synergize nicely with the uh, recoverable endless from Granada. So I took the core creation cost. But yeah, I, I wanted to take exploration, but I was like, nah. I blocked this, so I can go south now if I want to expand. And now I have, uh, I got a vassal who has a core and Naj, and and uh, Jaws will be overrun by the uh, the Ottomans and whatnot. So I'm happy. Um, anything else I gotta say? Yeah, all my war exhaustion ticked away. I got no overextension, and I stated all this up. Well, the best uh, states really. So this is a real juicy state, Garbia. It will be 44 after uh, I grab this, and then this state is now like 68. So I want all this in the peace deal. And then we'll just uh, peace out <laughs> the Mamluks. And the Ottomans won't even care because it's a co belligerent and a separate peace. So, yeah. Uh, anything else I gotta do before starting this? We are at 100% uh, religious unity. I converted it all. Um, I could uh, remove all my estates by now because I think uh, a lot of it ticked away. Yeah, I think most of the territory is already under the, the threshold of 25 autonomy. But I still got the uh, corruption, so I'll keep my estates until the corruption is all paid off. Do I have a mission for anybody? Yeah, improve relations with it, Charles. That won't work. Fig, Figwick, where was even Figwick? Oh, that's in Morocco. Um, I could take it in a separate piece, but is it really worth it? What does this mission give again? Land maintenance. Uh, oh, um, yeah, really a prestige for ten years. I could take it. Why not? So I am. Um, I got a big spy network in uh, Morocco already. I got a spy network in uh, in there. I'm ready here at full morale to stomp these guys. Alodia actually invaded the Mamluk. Of, or was it Makuria? I don't remember. I think it was Alodia. Yeah, they took this, the coastline. So the Mamluks only have like 22 army. 22k. It's worth checking what their force limit is, but yeah, if I can stomp them on their capital before uh, uh, Mamluks. It's worth checking what, what the war... Yeah, 32. They, they can match. I got the same force limit now as uh, the Mamluks. What will Hajjahs bring in? Uh, 15k maybe? Oh, no. 20k. Okay then. 20k from Ajaz and Morocco will bring in uh, 33,000. And what do the Ottomans have? 112,000 guys. So yeah, basically uh, I will now use the uh, I will now use the Ottomans to just uh, force make uh, separate pieces with these guys and annulling all their alliances and and whatnot. So yeah, that's the plan now. Is there anything else I need to do? It's, it's really stupid that I cannot make uh, Jaws arrival, but oh well. We'll see. So I hired a morale guy, I think. It's worth checking before I start. Yeah, I did. Uh, I asked for a general from the nobles, and I got like a uh, 2 3 2 1. That's very good for the, for the, for the uh, tradition general, I suppose. Is there anything I can mullock? Oh, I, I could mullock the, uh... These guys. But yeah, my man, my man power recovery, yeah, it, it wouldn't, uh, it would tick up again. Is this worth it? Nah, I'll use it when I really need it. Oh, I can do this now. So, 35, yeah, there's no way I can get a 100 diplomatic support. Still though, I can ask for a nice contribution, why not? I can just give him those uh, Monopoly charters, then go like, hey, give me the dosh. 
And I'm pretty sure I mulliced everybody. Well, that's nah, not worth it. So yeah, basically the plan now is to do what I showed in the screenshot. Do this, do that, do this, do that. Did the, the Mamluks do they have any other alliance? Cyprus, Hejaz, Morocco and Funge. Where in the world? Funge, yeah, they won't get involved. And they are like, what? Tech, tech 7? These are, uh, yeah, that, I don't care about Funge. I'm not even sure if everybody will be called in uh, versus this. It's worth checking if um, Morocco might be in depth or something. But yeah, we'll see about it. The Ottomans, will, if they join, they will just stomp everybody out of the war. And I will focus on the Mamluks. It's pretty sure that the Ottomans will protect me from Hejaz. And yeah, Morocco will likely full occupy all this, but I don't care. Ottomans can actually now walk all the way to my territory if they want to. There's no fort blocking this anymore. There was one in Alexandria, but I took it, so I see no reason why not to do this now. I probably should uh, lower my... Uh... So, I gotta be really careful here because uh, the, the Mamluks can call in the, uh, the Moroccans. But yeah, the Ottomans will join right away. So the Ottomans will uh, lose their alliance with... Uh... Yep, that will work. So, let's do it. Oh, yeah, I got away today. So, if the Ottomans join, I see no reason why... Yeah, they are doing it. There we go. Mamluks have honored their alliance, but they cannot call... Uh, so, Morocco will be at war versus the Ottomans. Bam! So, they don't even have a general. They will assign one. <laughs> Unless the AI is really stupid. And it seems it is really stupid. Go on. You are not gonna... Ah, not now he does so. 4-1, yeah, that's a bad one. Let's watch this battle. I will flank him and whatnot. I got more morale. Well, actually, no, I don't. Yeah, they maybe got an advisor or they are really pi pietists or whatever. So, please give me good chakras. 1 5, come on. 4 6. There's no way they can win this, but I was hoping for a quick wipe, but nah. 6 6. Well. I can chase them, by the way, and put them, but we got to see what's possible. Yeah, well, 3.7. Are they running to Morocco, I wonder? They might be. They might be. Might not be. Yeah, well, I, I can wait a bit with this. So, or maybe they are running here. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll just pursue them. See from there. Oh, the Ottomans will uh, arrive here eventually and probably uh, arrive before Hejaz. Yeah. Okay. So, Morocco lost their alliance with the Ottomans. Yeah, they are probably running away to uh, to their terrain over here or to Morocco. If they run into Morocco, I'll, I'll simply uh, return back and start a siege here. Well, I could leave 9k guys over there. Maybe it's a good idea, but yeah, I don't want to... If they run like over there, it's a good chance to wipe them out. I, disin I disinherited my hair and I get an even worse one. Oh well. Yeah, I don't think they will stop in Benghazi. If so, I will simply turn back. Yeah, they did stop. 
But I cannot reach him. Well, can I? Oh well. That's worth a shot. If they, uh, but they won't stop, I bet. Nah, they will simply run the hell away, I, and I won't be able to catch him. Two second does it. Well, actually, nah, it's not gonna happen. I'm gonna focus on his capital. Let's see from there. Actually. I could probably, uh, yeah, I can full occupy this guy. So let's see what he does. He might come back. There come the Ottomans. I'm hemorrhaging money here. Oh, they stop. But yeah, they, if I pursue them, they will just flee, flee, flee. And won't matter a thing. So, go there. I can go and uh, siege him up with like 10k guys. Oh, well, yeah, uh, maybe I should place my cavalry. Yeah, 10 will do. Bam. Then these guys can go. Why not split up? If I can place like 1k on all of his provinces. Well, maybe I should do that really. Should I? These guys are all uh, solid. The Ottomans are reinforcing demands, uh, reinforcing their troops, so it's likely that they aren't building any more troops over here. Um, I could say to the Ottomans, you go there and siege it all up myself. I'm fully willing to uh, let my capital be besieged. I don't care, it's just war exhaustion. Oh. I'll do this. Send the zero K okay guys. Rest up somewhere. Then just do. So. One over there, one over there. There, one. There's a lot faster way of doing this, but I never adapted to all the uh, shortcuts and uh, and the other stuff. So, is that everything? Nah, it's not. Fine with these guys, it should be everything. Oh. Yep. Okay. I just gotta watch what uh, Hajaz is doing. Morocco will likely focus on my provinces, and I and I'm not even sure if. Uh, they will come back. Yeah, they are coming back. I should at least... Oh. Okay, then. Then I don't have to send you. I, I just want to try to uh, occupy... Oh. Hey, troops again. These guys, they won't last. I 
I just want to occupy as much as possible. And reach all of his provinces before uh, these guys. They don't need to be there anymore. Um, the Mamluks will likely engage me somewhere, but... Anybody, yeah, they, that's why I occupy this. They they will desiege those stuff back. <laughs> I'll send them south. Yeah, they, here come the Moroccans, but I don't care. They will be busy with my uh my stuff. Should probably uh, send you there. I actually wonder if the, if the Ottomans are going to naval invade Cyprus, otherwise I'm in a bit of trouble here. Pretty sure they will do it eventually. Oh, come on. Gonna lose? When will you arrive? Five days? Aren't we? Nah. Oh well. Oh, where is you? Where are you even going? Huh? Are you running around? Yeah, that that might be a concern. If they get access to Ethiopia, they can actually. Oh, that's where. Oh, there they are. Oh, they are going for my vessel. Okay then. Can they go around? Yeah, they. Ethiopia. Yeah, they can do so. Did funds join in? I didn't see them. Yeah. So it's like 100, I don't know, against 60. So I'll outnumber these guys 2 to 1. I should occupy this as soon as possible. Then just... Uh, <laughs> they, they refused to occupy. Oh, they did. Okay. Yeah, I don't intend to do any more battles, really. I just wanted to route the Mamluks away so I could occupy them. Then we'll just uh, do all this to make to make sure he wastes a load of time by doing nothing. I could actually loot. Why not? Let's loot. Hello there. Last time I checked, Spain was other way. <laughs> yeah, Spain is the other. I already lost my course on Spain, but no nobody is, is saying that I gotta invade Spain in the 15th century. It wasn't possible. Uh, the Ottomans, they did, uh, they did rival Castile. The Ottomans did rival Castile, so yeah, might it might be that I can call in uh, Ottomans versus, uh, and they can reach it now. They can reach Spain if I uh, take this from the Mamluks now. They can actually reach Spain. The Ottomans are, oh, the Ottomans. Are, I mean the. Uh, The other guys, the Mamluks, are moving in. Walls breach on his capital. 
Yeah, and the Ottomans... Oh, they can bypass this. Huh. Okay. Please do. So, zone of control... <laughs> you see. Because my vassal is over here. You got a... Yeah, it's probably overlap. I don't, I'm not even sure if a capital fort does overlapping zone of control. But yeah, that, probably because I got a vassal here. The zone of control of this fort, they can just bypass it. Works for me. Yeah, the autumn. Uh, uh, they, they will probably go into a hot. Well, maybe I should place my troops there. All on top of the capital, so he doesn't get uh, funny ideas of engaging me. Sounds like a good plan. Let's place everybody there until uh, the sieges are done. Well, until the capital has fallen, I mean. Yeah, he's doing what I expected. He won't be able to reach that. Yeah. They can actually siege up their capital. That's, that's so... So, Ottomans, please siege up that. Siege up that. Oh no, my capital is under siege. Run for the hills. I'm actually tempted to engage this guy again, but... Why would I? Still low. The Ottomans are here. Uh, three from Shamar, three four. So I there's seven. Yeah, I could engage him. Maybe I should really, because if uh, if they team up with the Ottomans. Ah, uh, with the Ottomans. It's not this. So yeah, maybe I should engage him. Huh. Why can't you, can you go there and you not? So, this is 17k with everybody attached, so... Wah. If I do this, then that. Oh, it's it's only 8k. Huh. Enough. Oh, it, yeah, now it's 10k. Okay. So, how many. Oh, wait, no, that's not. How many. That's 18. I don't know. Should I really engage these guys? They will just run back there. Huh. Oh, don't hurt. But I, nah, I'm not going to do it. I should wait until all these guys are... Uh, until the fort is sieged up. Yeah, there's no point. He will simply route again. I got no chance of a stack wipe here. I might chase him off if I place uh, everybody here. Do that. I only got like what? It's a young heir. I don't want to fall into a regency here. 70 with age. Uh. Oh man. Can't go there and then there, right? Yeah. 
To engage or not to engage, that's the question. But yeah, my general is occupied here. I can cut him off, actually. Maybe that's the better idea. If I place my troops here, he'll be cut off. Oh, these guys cannot... Oh, they... That was a bad mistake. Wait, what? I cannot reach that. <sighs> Seriously? Ah, oh, what? Well, should I? 10th of January. Yeah, please do. Come engage me. I could leave these guys and say, yeah. I could even... I could probably lead them. Yep, I can. Uh, 18th of January. 24th of January. Sounds like... Let's just spook him off. If he get movement, if he gets movement locked, it's it's. Oh, I should have done that. Yeah, they're really moving in. So if I wait six days, oh. Six to four. Chicken shit. Oh, at least he's running away again. No desieging for you. Oh wait, what? He is. Oh no, that that must be this guy, right? I cannot imagine he he is riding here. That would be really weird. So how many do I have here? Three, four, six. Yeah, I need a couple of guys back there. You go there. Oh, do I even need? Yeah. I'll see. Yeah, he's not. Nah. Oh ho! Hi, Fudge. Huh. Fudge is joining the party over here. I see it. The 8th of February. Yeah, I cannot reach that. Well, 9th of February. That one might end of February. See you. <sighs> Nobody arrives there on the 8th. I, I should route these guys before they start. Uh, before they start occupying stuff in the name of. Uh, yeah, but what is even their military tech, I wonder? Fungi. Tech 6, yeah. <laughs> I can probably wipe these guys out. If I do like this. 9th of February. Did you. Do you. Yet Rallo is asking, do you still get re reconquista after forming Tannis? The achievement isn't grayed out. And somebody looked it up. The achievement doesn't get invalidated if you form other nations. So uh, it, it's still here. I can still form our, I can still form Andalusia, uh, restore all Andalus, blah blah, and I kept my Grenadian idea, so yeah. Oh wait, this guy might engage this guy, so uh, maybe I shouldn't send everybody in. He will twitch. I should wait until uh, 
Got his movement locked. Yeah, but he twitches anyhow. These guys, yeah. a bit too slow. Okay. I'll use some big back. Then they can waste more time uh, sieging stuff up. Huh. He's not running away. Okay. Yeah. Oh wait. I should probably uh, place my I don't know. Two guys? Oh, it's Shamar that's, uh... No Shamar. Don't attach. How many do I have here? Oh, they got a disease. Okay then, saw it. Do attach and do go there. Yeah, I'll I'll flank him. I'll yeah. Pff. I just need him gone. Oh, he did route here. Yeah, it might be a tooltip buck. He might still be routing. But I gotta be careful if these if this guy actually uh, turns. Yeah, it's a tooltip buck. He's still routing. So hi, Funge. How you doing? Let's fight in this. Uh, Tiny oasis next to the river. Give me a good shock, he says. We wiped him out, nevertheless. But oh, a jazz is coming. Also, that's not good news. A jazz is coming. Over. Uh, if anything, I should try and get, uh, yeah, I'll do that. I'll try and get the Ottomans to attach to me. I don't want them all to duck by me. Duck, little, little, duck. Sod it. What I mean, duck pile me in. A ah, Morocco is also on the way. That's not good. Yeah, my capital is almost gone. I don't care. I'll eat the war exhaustion. So, Hajaz, oh yeah, they are still. Everybody is still at high. I don't think. Even though Funge is, uh. Yeah, they say. Yeah, you, you wiped our army out, but. I don't care. Mr. Watermans, could you please attach to me? The Ottomans are not naval invading Cyprus. Oh, loss. Yeah, that's what I was hoping for. I can actually, uh, well, no. I would need Spain to form, then I can claim them. But Spain is now what I was meant, what I was uh, me meaning to say. Spain is now b bordering, well, not bordering, but they don't have distant war modifier, not anymore. So I can probably call them in now. They might even flag the Castilian land as vital, so I might be able to promise them that. Oh, huh. they are just chilling out. Mamluks is also still on high work, so and high but that'll drop as soon as I get his capital. 
I'm going to risk it. Or do I really want to drink my manpower? Probably should use mercs. This. Yeah. Should use mercs for this. Still outnumbered them. Hey, wait, where are you going? Huh. Mr. Waterman. Please. No, he says. Won't follow you, he says. I actually wonder if I remove the uh, the orders I give him. If that will uh, piece him up. There goes my capital. Yeah, maybe I should engage these guys before the uh, the Ottomans. Ah, the, Ottomans. the Moroccans come on over. If I piece out these guys, the uh, Jaws guys, then they will. Uh, I need this fort to fall. I, I don't even need full occupation of the Jaws. I just want to know their alliances. Take their gold and whatnot. How many do I? I'm not even sure. Huh. Where's the fucking off? They're chilling out over here. Huh. Are they afraid to come on over here? Probably. Don't tempt me to kill you. But yeah, if these forts fall, I can probably piece him out without engaging him. I don't want to fight if the Ottomans can do it for me. Huh. I don't even need to dishonor their alliance anymore because the Mamluks dishonored it. Oh, thank you very much, said uh, Ottomans. That was I. That'll help. Some subsidies. Please do. Wait, what? Ah, oh, come on. Did my general just die there? I just. I just uh, died in the siege. He died in the siege. Oh, well. Yeah, but I got no... Well, any general then is better than no general. <laughs> I'm willing to roll one more time. Yeah. Oh, well. If you aren't attaching to me, I may as well go that way. Huh. What are you doing? Wait, what? Why are you engaging this guy, you stupid vassal? Don't make me... And I don't even have a... Oh, wait. I got a general from Shamar here, right? Yeah, I shouldn't, have, I shouldn't have rolled for the bloody general. Wait for me. So when will he arrive? The 13th? Mm, I could attach to him. And then we will arrive on the 16th. Then I can engage him here. Yeah, sounds like a plan. Why not? Sixteenth. Oh. I always thought if you attach to the, somebody, they stop and wait for you, but it seems not. Oh. I'll win. Easily. Ah, where are you even running now? Alexandria? It's not a shattered retreat. 
Oh well. At least I got them loaded. it. Does this general have a siege pip? No, he doesn't. At least he, uh, he attaches to me. Everybody routed is better than uh, them engaging me all at once. Ah, come on. So, still high, you say? Yeah, here come the Ottomans. Uh, the Mamluks again. I'm gonna check their uh, if they are loaning up and stuff. Um, Lux. No. Okay, they don't have loans yet. It will show here, by the way, in the score comparison. If it says loans, each 0 0.02 is one loan. They cannot. If this capital falls, he will likely uh, peace out. Not 100%, mind you, but... But I want to guide these guys around. Could you please? There we go. He's already at medium. So what should I get? I I'm going to prep a peace deal here to see what... Uh, I'm pretty sure this is it. This, this... What is the capital state again? Asyut, Rasjirab, Fayum. Okay. This. Yeah, that's what I want, basically. But, no, they say. They are close, though. If I settle them for a couple of months, I don't even have to engage their army. Anybody else? Well, I, I could engage him, but is that worth it? I don't think so. Uh, oh, hi Ottomans. I actually wonder, can I use their fleet? No. I was wondering if I could uh, use their transport. Well, it's worth a shot. No. Doesn't work that way, he says. You get it? I still got some loot here, so I'll, I'll keep on looting. The Ottomans can go and occupy whatever they want, really. Hi, Podinkip. Yeah. You missed the, uh, the explanation of what happened at the... Uh, I just started streaming, but I like like 20 years. I started an another war versus the Mamluks, promising them uh, the Ottomans land. And I waited until the Ottomans peaced out on their own. Then did a 100% peace deal and managed to keep the Ottomans friendly. Well, to keep the alliance with, a, with some shenanigans, basically knowing how the game works. I kept the alliance with the Ottoman, and now I am promising them Cyprus. And I called Mamluks in as Fulco belligerent, of, uh, and that dragged Hejaz, Fungi, and Morocco in. So I annulled the uh, the, the, the alliance between Morocco and uh, the Ottomans by doing this. Yeah, but I should engage these suckers because otherwise, if he gets. Um, I should engage him really before Morocco gets here. Yeah, but 22 versus 27. If anything, I wanna. Yeah, but that's too much. I don't have the force limit to go here. So can I piece out? I just already know. One. I got a 3-3 general from Shamar. If I engage him, he will probably separate peace out. So I think it's worth it. He might even run. Now, I cannot wait I cannot wait for the Moroccans to join them. So how is the war with Morocco going? <laughs> they are fully occupying me, but I don't care. 
I'll eat the war exhaustion, and even if uh, separatists spawn anywhere, the Mamla and the Ottomans will kill me. It's a pretty unorthodox way. I n almost never use forts. Uh, I want to pay off my corruption. And I just eat the war exhaustion. I don't care. Call me insane, but uh, it works. I don't believe in forts. I believe in paying for troops. And being at force limit. Talking about force limit. Yeah, I can actually f hire five more mercs. Is that worth it? I don't think so. I'm already flanking this guy. And I got a morale advisor. So yeah, I can just ride him probably. Unless he... <sighs> yeah, but I, I want to... I want to peace out the Mamluks as soon as possible. And probably after this battle is over... Yeah, I'll do it. Sod it. Some good rolls here. Oh, they got they getting a jazz involved. Seven to nine. Yeah, he won't win it even with the reinforcements. Five to eight. Uh, 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 three to nine. Ah, oh, come on, game. And now Fung is joining in. Oh, oh come on. Don't tell me I'm gonna lose this. <laughs> if so, I'll just murk up hard and uh... But after... Oh man, come on. 29... Yeah, I did join. Ah, bloody hell. Should have made mercs from the start here. Make mercs from the start here. Might still win this, but ooh, this is gross. 17. Ah. Huh. Oh, here come the Ottomans. Uh, okay, I'll probably. If I throw in my mercs now. Oh man. But this is, yeah, I, I had to do this before the uh, Moroccans come on in. That was a bad mistake. I didn't see, f I should have checked if uh, any other troops then had jumped. I didn't see those Funge guys. So, yeah, this, I got nine morale. Oh, they lost it. You gotta be kidding. <laughs> Come on, game. Oh well, time to murk up. So, are these guys... Nah. He has movement luck, he has movement luck. Are the Ottomans movement luck? Yeah, probably. Murk hard, guys. And I cannot believe I lost that fight. And now they will be, uh, well, I don't know. I could go do like this now, but I'm greedy. Uh, so these guys, they, yeah, they got maximum, uh, but they got battered units. They won't get tech of morale. Oh, five. Yeah, I might be able to disperse it. I want a 100. Wait, what? Oh, come on. That guy arrived too early. If I throw enough guys in. God, oh, he didn't have an. Either. If I throw enough mercs in, I might still win this. 
Well, I might still win this. Might. No, 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 I shouldn't do it like this. I don't want to rout. <sighs> this feels like not worth it, but... Oh, they are coming. I need uh, to piece out the Mamluks as soon as possible. <laughs> and I totally forgot about my own troops, of course. Join the, the damn battle also. Oh, I don't know. If they lose this battle, it's a they uh, will probably peace out 107 peace deal, but yeah. This feels like a waste, really. I should have gotten that 88 peace uh, deal. I'm greedy! Uh, but they are gonna lose it. Oh man. Well, who knows? These guys arrive soon enough. I might just stall this battle long enough. Might. Big might though. And Rockins are coming. Not good. Uh, is this even possible? Yes it is. I can stall the fight and probably do a 100% peace deal on it. Oof. And now it's like a uh, retreat to the hills and see if they accept that 100% uh, peace deal. Hoping. No! Oh, come on. Okay, this fight was a, a big waste of time then. Uh, Double check the states here. Yeah, this is Garbia. This is, yeah. If I piece them out now, they'll have to re-siege Cairo. Do I really want this? It's like, what? Seven development? I can live without it. Do it in the next war. Should have pieced them out already. I was greedy. Uh... I can do this now, and the Ottomans won't care, because it's a separate peace deal. They won't lose to us. 1485, I can even start coring it. And then the Ottomans will uh, wipe out the um, Mamlukian separatists that will spawn in Cairo. Or God forbid, they might even spawn on top of uh, Morocco if they siege Cairo, so it's there any... Let's see what my... Yeah, they only got like 101 gold. It's not worth Well, I could wait. I could wait. Just let them take out. Yeah, why not? Sit on a uh, Kiriro. These guys, yeah, they will probably not engage me. I can give it a couple ticks of the month, and I might still get my, uh, my plus 100. Too many pop-ups. 
So, do I have any troops that I... Okay. Hemorrhaging money. Do I even want to root out corruption now? I'll... Root it. I want that corruption gun, really. This capital falls from a jazz. They'll be out of the war also, and then it's like Ottomans versus the Moroccans. Uh, should I build a fleet? I don't know. How many do the Cyprians even bring? 6,000, 9,000, 10,000. I would need like 15 cogs. And then I can invade them and give it to the Ottomans. Well, I could, do, I could just peace out. Bear with me here. I could just peace out the Jazz, peace out Morocco, and do a white peace with... <laughs> A white piece with Cyprus and they still, uh, yeah, why not? Maybe that's the better option, then I can promise some land. If I do a white piece with Cyprus, then the Ottomans won't care. Even though they fought all of these guys, they won't care because uh, I don't take land in the main peace deal. Huh. Now let's let's see in April what if they go low war enthusiasm the the Ottomans I mean the uh, Mamluks I mean oh still up medium no they don't want oh. are they actually gaining didn't they accept this just now. Oh yeah, it's probably the goal. Uh, they are still willing to accept this. I shouldn't be greedy, really. Yeah, because if, if Morocco desieges all of it... If Morocco desieges all of it, he'll simply... Uh, no. Don't be greedy. Let's just take this and run. The fort will be mine and I'll pay for it. So he, he cannot go there, there. He can't. This fort is basically blocking uh, to go there. He'll be out of the walls. He can siege. Uh, he has to siege this. Morocco cannot do anything to me. If I say, hey, bye, I, I'm, I'll move into Jerusalem. Yeah, I should do it. It'll cost me an arm and a leg in diplo power, but. Eh, why not? They don't have allies anymore. Well, yeah, I, I could annul uh, Morocco and Funch. So, uh, I won't annul alliances in the peace deal with the Lux. So, yeah, why not? Should have done this before uh, engaging these guys. I knew it wasn't worth it to uh, engage them, but I did it anyhow. Please remind me next time though, to always follow my gut feeling. I don't get the idea. Uh, should I core it now? I can wait and yeah, but it, the war exhaustion will only get higher. I could pay it down a little. Ah, uh, but do I really want to? Just to get more coring costs? Well, how many? Plus 30%. Nah, I'm gonna start the cores, I think. That said, now because Morocco will likely just occupy all this, and no, I, d I won't start it. I'll just sit on it. How many? There's 74. I'll just sit on this. Ha! And they get black flag. Hi, Morocco. So let's double check. I didn't get anything nasty with you, right? No. Gonna max out my uh So I should basically use my uh my spy network now to uh claim all the rest. That's really high development. This one. Bam. 
I already uh, improved relation with anybody that isn't in the war, so they don't care. It's only Hajaz, then they'll be on the truth. <coughs> I could throw my cannon in here. Yeah, but they already have cannons. I'm just gonna wait here. Oh, they they do have garrison. Okay, because I, I, I thought I started that low garrison here if I take the full, but no, it's already at maximum. Well, I don't even need I don't even need to stay here. This for yeah, well actually, I'm not even sure if they if they ask access from the Mangmlex now, can they bypass this fort? I don't know. Does it matter? I can go and get Fungi out. Is that, is that worth it? I mean, <sighs> let's see, Fungi. The French Bob. Uh, country. I'm just looking if he has a high. Uh, yeah, five treasury. It's not worth it. As soon as the war is going on for like three years, it doesn't matter what they do. Kara still doesn't know about me, but they do get... Huh. I always thought if it was an exclamation mark here, they couldn't get aggressive expansion, but it seems they can. They don't know about me, but they still got aggressive expansion. Huh. Oh well. Might be worth it then to uh, improve relations with those guys. I don't want them to join a coalition. Nobody else is really close. Nah, just, no. Might be worth it to uh, Maxima. And I do, uh, yeah, the, the spy network in uh, Morocco, that might come in handy. But do I want to take on Morocco on my own? Nah. They outnumber me. I should wait until the Ottomans uh, finish sieging all this up. So 21, 38 they got. No, that's not worth it. Especially as long as uh, Jazz is involved. Ah. Do I care for Fungi? Do they even have troops left? I think not. No. Fungi. Fungi Bob, yeah, he has some troops left. But I, I think, uh, how long would it take me to get there? 11th of August. Uh, and I cannot... Ah, uh, well. Uh, he might go uh, and accept white peace if I place my troops on his capital. Is that really worth it? Yeah, I don't see Morocco defeating the Ottomans. So maybe... It is worth it. What's the worst that could happen now is Morocco, Hejaz, blah blah, all dockpiling the fort here, but they cannot get past. My only fear is that... Can I go... Can I move here through Ethiopia? No, I cannot. I could ask for... access from mid Ethiopia. If these... Uh, my only fear was they, they all come south and stomp me here. That won't happen. So... I go after them. Probably a good idea. I could annul their alliance and whatnot. Yeah, but 29 guys is overkill, really. I could send like... Yeah, I could split up and send my mercs. That sounds like a plan. So... Anybody that isn't a uh, merc, catch. I'll give you the cannon, and you go and siege that up, and I'll go over there. And we'll see from there. 
Did I unthink it? Yeah. Go there. Oh, we have gained greater power status. Oh yeah. Granada and Teutonis into greater power, folks. So, do I want to influence anybody? France, maybe, but they are a greater power themselves. I'm hoping I can uh, rival Castile. France already rivaled Castile, so uh, if I rival Castile, they might go friendly. Cannot influence other greater powers, but uh, now what? What is even possible? I've, let's check this. Influence nation, take debt, intervene, break alliance. Do I need to break anybody's alliance? Oh, yeah, actually. Actually. Well, I don't. They will simply say, uh, oh, yeah, I need positive prestige. Sort it. As soon as this fort fall and that fall, fort falls, a jazz will be out. I'm looks so out already. And I don't plan on taking uh, land from Ajaz or Morocco, just an all their alliances and uh, then I can go for them whenever they want, whenever I want to. You might see Portugal invading Morocco if I annul their alliance with, uh, with the Ottomans. Ah, uh, wait a moment. They are not allied anymore. Yeah, I forgot. <laughs> because the Ottomans are at war with them. I don't even need to annul the alliance. I can just white piece out the uh, Moroccans and say, I'll be back. Do I even bother about Cyprus? No. If the Ottomans want, want me to give it, <laughs> they'll have to work for it. Adjuran is in trouble. Probably an ambassador over there. So I'm wondering if, uh, yeah, they are probably, are they pursuing me here? I don't know. So let's see. I don't think they can bypass this, but they got access through the uh, through the Mamluks, so I'm wondering if they can bypass it. I see it, yeah. And they are probably going all the way around and uh, over here. So, Mr. Hajar, still high war enthusiasm, you say, but you are almost fully occupied. Seriously. Yeah. He's Isaac moving in to uh, stomp me here, maybe. But he's probably moving uh, to Makkah here, through Ethiopia. This fort will fall. So, is that worth it? Uh, mer well, actually, mercenary maintenance, that might help. But I need this. I need... How many did I need for coring? Uh, I'm gonna... Well, this war will probably drag on for a while. Mercenary maintenance. Yeah, and I'll get tolerance of Edens. Not that I have Edens, but still. First three ideas sound like a good plan. Yeah, I'll do it. So, now I pay like uh, 8.41 for the mercenaries. Let's see what that becomes in October. Probably not a lot less. <laughs> Nothing less. Mercenary maintenance. It's, it's kind of really weird. Yeah. Oh, there there we go. That's Hijaz. They will accept white peace now. And Farnish probably also. Let's see. Nah. They would offer me white peace if they were uh, a global. 
But now the Ottomans are backtracking. That's good. Now I want to say to the Ottomans, hey, uh, please go and occupy my capital. You can actually assign, uh, you can actually assign allies to desiege your own forts in the province window with this button. Ottomans will try to see this province and go for their capital. I don't think I can reach anything. Uh, actually, no, cannot. And the allies usually listen to your commands. What are, what are they even doing? Some sort of propaganda text is circulating in the court about how blah 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 is a ruthless power among but this might impact our relations with it. Yeah, I don't want to lose the bullet. Solid diplo power. So yeah, now it's worth it actually to try again. This. Hey Mr. Ottomans, will you attach to me? I'll let the Ottomans go first. Ajaz have dishonored their alliance with nice. Very good. The AI, you see the AI, uh, they jump as soon as the AI sees that a nation is occupied and dishonors, uh, will dishonor an, uh, an alliance, you will see other wars erupt. So basically those war you just saw are all because of my war. Huh, <laughs> Avengers again there. Yeah, but they'll be out soon. So will you attach to me? Probably not. I can see where they are going. Oh there. Wait, what? Oh I forgot, damn it. They cannot reach my Oh that's a bad mistake. Silly me. They cannot reach Wait what yes they can. The Ottomans give ac they give access. You can reach it. Why are you going north? Huh. Come on Ottomans, I need you to uh, help me out here. I don't wanna fight off Morocco on my own. Oh. They cannot bypass my fort. Don't care. If I'm lucky the Mamlupian the Mamlukian separatists will spawn on top of uh, the Moroccans here. And it'll be a lot of Mamlukian separatists. 35k so if they spawn upon if they siege down Kiro they are likely to spawn there. Anonymous. Seriously? Why are you going back? Well. Oh. Now they want to attach. Okay. You move there. And you wait for them. It might be they are moving in to attach to me now. No? What are you even doing? Ah, now he says, yeah, let's go and see. You, if you attach to an ally, you can actually see where he's going. Yeah, he wants to occupy more of a jazz. No. If anything, I, want, I should piece him out now, probably. So, do you have any alliances left? No. I could actually white piece him out and take all their gold. Damn. Yeah, why not? I could do this right now and then the Ottomans won't move so. How long does this 1529? Yeah, okay. Then they cannot re-ally anybody before I invade them. Um, 31 October 29. And they cannot re-ally before... 1531. Yep, I'll do it. And the Ottomans aren't cheesed because, uh, that I didn't give him anything. Come on, Ottomans. 
I need you to go and uh, kill the Morocco for me now. He'll do it eventually. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, I recalculate what am I even supposed to do now. There they go. <laughs> I wanna attach to you, I wanna attach to the other guy. Saida. Ambus. Here's the hoping that they actually will attach to me, if not. Yeah, they are still at high war enthusiasm, so it's not... Yeah, they are moving in. Okay. I was worried there for a little while that they, they wouldn't... Uh, that they wouldn't do it. So let's prep a peace deal for Funge also, so these guys aren't involved and cannot... Well, don't they accept... Separate piece yet? No. Okay, let's follow the, the Ottomans here. If they engage these guys, I should follow them. Yeah, they do. Oh, but he is gonna get involved, probably. Still, though, 21, 34. Yeah. And the, this stack might re reinforce also. So what is the general of uh, Ottomans? One, two, one. Oh. Wait, what? He's moving out again. Huh. Yeah, Ottomans, do some work for me. Kill these suckers. What a I mean. Oh. So, Mr. Waterman guy, you please, pretty please, attach to me. No, you say, ah, oh, come on. You gotta move into Morocco here. I gave you the order, damn it. Is there anybody else in the war he might be going for? Funge, yeah, that's maybe it. <laughs> So Funge, how about that? If I get peace out, yeah, I'll be. I am close actually. If I peace this guy out, he can only go into. Uh, and the war has only been busy for three years. So the Ottomans will go into Morocco. Fighting. Yeah, go on in. Go on in. Please do. I don't get why these guys are. Maybe they want to uh, reinforce. Yeah, that's probably it. The ally doesn't send in uh, stacks that aren't reinforced to full strength. What are these guys waiting for? Oh, is he naval invading him? Yeah, he is actually. Or is it a fleet? Highlands terrain? No, they are in. Wait, what? Oh, that's this guy. Okay. I'm actually wondering. 8k, 9k versus his 10k? Ah. Uh, you really think you can win there? Looks like it. I can wipe this circle out. Do I really need to? Why not? Morocco cannot reinforce so why? At least the Ottomans are moving in now. Ah, come on. They will likely lose that. Yeah. I don't get why the Ottomans are naval invading with such low amount of troops. Well... I need to remember to uh, place at least 1k 
in this territory anyone basically so that they cannot cancel the axis <sighs> tell me the Ottomans cannot move to Mamluk somehow they got conditional axis right ah. Ottomans has conditional axis through the Mamluks yeah what are they waiting for yep I don't get it. Is there any reason why the uh, the Ottomans wouldn't move into Cairo here? Uh, into oh, why aren't you doing anything? Let's say I don't want you to do it. Maybe then I'll do it. Oh yeah, he might be. He might be see. Trying to naval invade. Yeah, that's probably it. He might. He, he says, "Yeah, I want to do it, but I'm gonna go by boat because it's the shortest route." Please don't go by boat, Ottomans. Yeah, that seems to have worked. It seems to have worked. Maybe if you assign a province to siege it up in the province window, they will say, "Yeah, let's take the shortest route there." Huh? Okay then. And what about this siege over here? Yeah, okay. Finally. Move on back. Uh, here, why not? Yeah, they are moving back for into their nation for some reason. Enough. I'll just re-siege all of my territory. Are they cowering, I wonder? Are they saying, Oh no, Tunis and the Ottomans are coming. Let's hide in our mountains now. I'm so afraid. In the case... What are they even running about? At least one stack seems to be on the way to the uh, Moroccans. <laughs> now the separatists are coming. Oh well, too late. Port will stop him at least. Yeah, he's just moving into his territory to chill out again. I don't get it. What is he even doing? Is, are the Moroccans naval invading or something? Naval invasion AI is so bad, Puddingkip says. Let's invade. Yeah. 33 corruption. Yeah, but it's lower already. Uh, it was at 45. I'm paying to root it out now. I miss send somebody. <sighs> Look at them. They just abandon everything they occupied and they say, yeah, let's chill out in our own nation. I don't get it. These guys are still probably saying, yeah, but naval invasion is so much faster. Ah, huh. now they are now they are coming with a with a good fleet. Yeah, Cyprus won't. Yeah, I'll reward you with Cyprus then, Ottomans. Being such a good buddy, you can have it. And I might even <laughs> you'll probably laugh, but if I separate piece out all these guys and and give them uh, Cyprus, they will even owe me favors because I don't get anything in the main peace deal. <laughs> Oh well, abusing uh, abusing game mechanics is not exploiting in my book. Super rough. <laughs> I'm actually wondering if the they. 
If I, they might naval invade this. Yeah. We don't want to go around. We want to take a boat. Because a boat is shorter. Oh, but we don't have boats. Oh yeah, so let's wait like five years in a row. Until there is room. That's what the AI does for you. I send somebody? Oh, come on guys, seriously? They are waiting for, for naval transport probably. Where are these transports? Don't tell me... Wait, what? Where is even a fleet? Transport fleet, hello. Oh, here. Oh. Don't tell me they lost all their tra- Oh, it's this one. Oh well. If I just occupy all my terrain again, I can white piece out Morocco. <laughs> so I don't even need the Ottomans, probably. I didn't do a single bat battle with him yet, and if the Ottomans now say, Hey, uh, Ottomans, try it again. Please go and siege up their capital. Yeah, but I... I should siege up all this first, in case the Ottomans are going for my capital first. You're splitting up, for fuck's sake. I I'll just annul this. It seems the AI just gets confused with your orders. Cyprus seems to, seems to have gone wild in your heartland. That's not Cyprus. Morocco. Morocco all invaded that. Oof. Morocco uh, all occupied that in the name of... Uh, in the name of uh, what am I looking for? Morocco occupied it in the name of the war leader because they will only flag their vital territory. This, this tells me that this is their vital territory. And then they'll flag everything else they occupy in the name of the war leader. Cyprus is war leader here. I declared on Cyprus with the and promising uh, the Ottomans Cyprus, basically. They can have it. But uh, this means the Ottomans helped me versus the Mamluks, versus Hejaz, versus Fungs, versus Morocco. They even lost their alliance with Morocco because I did that. And a couple of wars already erupted in Arabia because of my move. Oh, that said. Did I max out you? Yeah, why not? Oh wait, no, I should um, piece out Funge first. So Mr. Funge guy, Funge Bob. Yeah, I don't want you allied with the Mamluks. Please give me all the gold and uh, oh, war reparations. Maybe I should... Oh, I cannot even ask for an old rivalry, okay. <laughs> I could vassalize them, but they are too big. It's not worth it. I just want them uh, gone, really. If you are not alliances, wars might erupt here, and I want them busy. Better busy on the amidst their own than busy against me. Yeah, give me the war operation, and that's my, pretty much everything, I think. I'm actually wondering if I annul the alliances with Ethiopia, they cannot ally Ethiopia. Yeah, I saw it. Bam. These rebels might actually trigger uh, the Ottomans to come and kill them. I'm hoping. Uh, any guy free? 
Dr. Steel is actually uh, an Aragon or actually fabricating claims on me. So... Yeah, well... Yeah, you go siege my capital then. No, you say. Huh. Might be naval AI that's uh, interfering here. Huh, now they joined up again. Could you please attach to me? They simply refuse. Yeah, now they are going for my capital. Okay. So that I'll just attach to you and see. Uh, I don't get where. What? What? What are they even doing? Where is Morocco even hiding? Oh, now they are coming back. Retreat! And retreat and... Oh. As dear, yeah. It's probably triggered if, if I step on their vital territory. It's probably uh, triggering them to come on... Uh, so yeah, let, let's wait a bit. Let's see. My troops are on the way there. Also, Ottomans. No, no. This this stack is probably still waiting for transport, and they are placing more people there. Go ahead, Ottomans. Knock yourself out. If anything, I want them to go uh, into Egypt now. Yeah, they might actually be doing that. They might waste their time again, sieging all this up. I gotta wait until all my forces are... Uh... So, let's hide near the Ottomans and wait until my... Uh... My guys are near. I don't, it won't take that long. I actually gotta see and be watchful that I don't win, run into these guys. Yeah, maybe I should actually. Uh... Wait, what? He's splitting up again. Uh, where is he even going? Don't tell me it's going for the career for That would be hilarious. Yeah, I can do silly stuff like that, run into my rebels, because it, he's thinking, yeah, I gotta kill these, otherwise I, c I won't get war score. That would be so hilarious. If he's, he's moving into Egypt now, he'll waste a ton of time. Yeah, but I gotta watch this here. That I don't run... Oh, did I? Yeah, I still got my guy over there. As long as the Ottomans are seizing Cyprus, they will never get out of the war. I miss. Yeah. Yep, they are splitting up. Suwara. They are trying to engage me here. I outmaneuvered them. So if I go there now, they are movement locked. And let's hope they cannot engage me in Jaffa. Nah, they cannot. Yep, he's going for my fort. Hey, oh wait, there's still this 1k. <laughs> yeah, that's a nice diversion. Please go there. And now my capital will be uh, sieged up again. Argla, what's the shortest way to your capital, I want? Yeah, let's go to Hardna. The, the Moroccans could do whatever they damn please. I don't care, I don't want to fight them. Yeah, they will lose time again. Ah, there goes the fort. Rebels occupied it pretty quickly, but 
because rebels occupy land in my nation now, it might trigger these guys to come and kill them, but... So. <laughs> he's really, he's really splitting up, that's funny. Jofra, don't make... Let's de-seize all of it. If this falls, yeah, the Ottomans now can uh, engage these guys. Please do. While I siege up everything. So to speak. There must be a better way of doing this, but... I should really learn to use the uh This is capital, right? Yep. He might actually accept why peace if I place troops on top of his capital. And the Ottomans. Let's hope they split up. So what's the, uh, oh, they got army tech 9 also, and they got 10. I sh should max out weapons again. I don't want them going hostile. Let's do that. Oh, come on, ornaments, it's not a little bit overkill, placing 44 troops, 44k, and taking attrition for not. So what are they even doing? Oh. They don't want to engage him, so Ottomans. I'd go to Fez now. Ready, please? Holy ma. Ah, uh, 75. Yeah, I gotta do this. Already got 75. I could actually reach. Nah. Reach this fort. The moment this gets these seeds, he will rethink his options. Huh, <laughs> there goes my 1k stack. Well. I need a merc over there. Uh, I, I'll just... Nah, that's silly Alex. Uh, place one over here maybe. Nah, heck, even, even here is better. Oh. A steel has inherited the throne of Aragon. That tells me they formed Spain. Okay. The rebels are likely to go. Where is that murky? Did build one, right? Yeah. Just want to make sure they cannot cannon cancel the access. They won't, but it's always best to be sure. Yeah. Where are they going now? <sighs> Come on. Could you please listen to my commands and go here? <laughs> Castile is no longer considered a greater power. Yeah, of course, because Castile no longer exists. That's funny. So how's your war enthusiasm, Morocco? It's already medium. They won't accept YP yet, otherwise he would offer it to me. I, I did place my cannon on Fez, right? Yep. Okay. <sighs> and everybody else just... Meet up, I don't know, over there. 
Ah, you go and waste time. I don't care. If I get Morocco out now, <laughs> the Ottomans will go for my rebels. And I got a 100 spy network in Morocco. So, what is it again? Yeah, you get minus 20, uh, the seed soccer gets 20% shorter if you got a 100% spy. You please. Love of God, move your cannons on top of Fez. It's probably not gonna do it. No, he says. I as friends and did they turn hostile? You go do whatever you damn please, Ottomans. Figwig. You please go and kill somebody instead of occupying. Oh yeah, I, I could reach that, I forgot. But this is like yeah, that's like the only province I can reach. <laughs> oh, I could loot. That's loot. I don't want to kill my own rebels. Not if, uh... Not if there's Ottomans to kill them for me. <sighs> what now? Bavaria? Wait, what? Hungary got a, p a personal union over Austria. You gotta be kidding me. Again? I've <laughs> seen this happen in the Haida campaign. And now, uh, uh, PU mechanic at work life, folks. Hungary, is it a succession war? Yes, it is a su su succession war. And Bohemia, yeah, they border Hungary. So you might see Austria or Hungary eating a big bite out of... Uh, and Bohemia will likely be on their own because they declared offensively. Poland might join if it, they are uh, a rival of uh, Poland. Rival, yeah. Hungary, yeah. They, Poland might join. We'll see. Oh, PU mechanic at work. Live on screen. I'm gonna grab a bite. Maybe I should speed for this. It's actually funny that uh, as long as Cyprus isn't occupied, I'm still at negative war score. How is that siege going? 28%, okay. Bavaria is the Emperor. Bavaria? Not big. So I won't get taking war score. Uh, call for peace, I mean. Yeah, and now these guys, yeah, they are coming back. I'll speed for this and watch the Ottomans killing, uh, whatever. Ha, <laughs> game is telling me to kill, uh, to make ships. Import some food to combat the famine. Oh, yeah, okay. They are moving in here. And they are. Okay. I'm gonna recall a guy and see what peace deal is possible. Oh, it's slow. Okay, I can piece him up. Yeah, 
I need war score to demand anything, but I want to. I'm a greedy guy. How many do they have? Yeah, they will. They will probably engage me here, which isn't good. Well, actually, no, they don't. Yeah, please, please let me occupy your okay? Yeah, they're going for these guys, probably. Okay, not speed reading. They are going around here to uh, go to fast, probably. 23, 33, yeah, they will win that because fast is mountains. If so, if they set a foot in here, I'm out. I'll piece him out. No, he says. Okay. Huh. If that guy get movement locked, I'll reinforce the fight, and we wipe. We might win it before this guy can even reinforce. But that's risky. Really want to risk that. Mm. This guy will simply say, let's join the fight. Authority. I think I'll win the battle before this guy can win. What can I even get if I don't peace out? Let's see. 275 ducats. Is that worth it? That what we're fighting for? Yeah, I could annul their alliances and whatnot. I should do it. Should go though. Sixth of April. <sighs> He's low war enthusiasm, so he'll peace out. But if he wins the battle, it might go up again. I want Morocco to uh, annul their alliance with the Mamluks. So I can stomp down Morocco. Oh well. My gut feeling is telling me don't do it. Yeah, he isn't even moving. Huh. Ah, now he is. Okay, 17th of April. I'll probably win the battle before it's reinforced. Yeah, 10 more days, I'll win it. Probably. He's moving out again. Huh. Yeah, it's this guy that... Uh, ah, okay. Then I don't even need... So... I still think I don't... Yeah, I don't have 10 war score on him. I need to occupy his capital, but that, that'll be uh, pretty soon. Wait, what? Doesn't oh fast as such low? I, I thought it was a lot bigger. Okay. Oh. What was it? Seventeen. Mm. Oh man, I've been taking a there there then for uh for not five percent attrition. Was silly. Oh! Please dishonor, Morocco. Yes, I don't even need... I don't even need to annul their alliance anymore. This is great. But wait, what? Who attacked the Mamluks? One of these guys again, probably, Mercuria? 
Ja, maar kun je eens zingen? Ja, laat ze in vrede namelijk snappen. All because I declared the war. Um, please stay here, vassal. Please stay here. I set him to support him. Come on. Please stay there. Don't get wiped. Nothing. Man, the Ottomans might stumble. They are drawn to my occupied provinces. And they might stumble into the rebels. I hope so. my king dying. Ah, damn it, and it's a long regency. I cannot declare war for uh, 10 more years. Not good. Well, I shouldn't have disinherited my heir. Uh... Yeah. So, Morocco, how about now? Please give me a dosh. Now we'll get 154. Uh, if I do this, then they cannot be ally. Yeah, I can. I can do a, a long truce now. Oh yeah, I, can, I, I should humiliate him. Wait a moment. Humiliate war operations. Uh, another lot and rivalry, but uh. But me, because yeah, I will probably. Yeah, they won't accept it. Okay, simply the golden. Not enough. That looks nice. Morocco will be humiliated. I'll get some power projection. Yeah, let's do it. Oh, yeah. That's <laughs> one thing that I forgot. Yeah, well, I hope I'll still have access. Oh, they did all. Oh, I was wondering, did they do it already? No. Yeah, I lost my access with the. Damn it! I shouldn't have done it. I should have waited until my troops were back. Yeah. Oh well. The war is basically won at this point, so... So, did I lose it? Yes, I did. Oh well. The uh, Ottomans won't get black flagged and they will still uh, kill my uh, troops. These guys won't give me access not in a million years, but the Ottomans will be will sooner or later. Yeah, see, they are coming over now. They will kill the rebels sooner or later, and then I'll just score it. So it's just Cyprus now. The Ottomans uh, still didn't lose any trust whatsoever because. Uh, I still didn't make peace with the land they were promised, so if I say, hey, Ottomans, yeah, you can have it. You can have it. I plan to kill the Ottomans. No, I, I'm not gonna kill them. They are my attack dog. I don't wanna kill the Ottomans. Yeah, and some gold. Should I wait until, uh... Maybe that's for the better. 
Please kill my rebels first before you get what I want. Yeah, now it's happening. And these guys might reinforce that battle and uh, these guys also, yeah, the rebel looks like the rebels are toast. Let's make sure of it. Yeah, these guys are reinforcing. Yeah, they'll join up in three days and then these guys will also... Yeah, I don't want to take attrition. Yeah, they are dead. These guys are... Uh... Thanks so much, Ottomans. You're a really good buddy, you know. You are a so nice guy. Oh. Yeah, okay. I'm close to getting... Uh... I gotta watch this so carefully. This is because my king died, yeah. It's luckily that I see this now. Phew! If, if I would have gone below uh, 100%, 100, uh, this is basically how I keep Ottomans as a friendly. As long as I'm above 100, they cannot go hostile. Even if it has a... Uh... Now what? Yeah, let's just kill all the mercs. I cannot declare wars and, and no, uh... Ooh, forgot about these guys. Canadian peasants. I can kill those and then, uh... I can kill those and then kill them. Let's see how the other separatists are. Anybody? Yeah, they will have low... Noble rebels, why is that? Doesn't having Egypt eventually cause others to turn hostile due to missions? Uh, yes, random neck, but the uh, the Ottomans need to have. Uh, uh, I forgot. But I'm pretty sure they need a, a province over here to get the mission on uh, on the Mamluks. But why would they even declare on the Mamluks? They cannot core anything from them except this. Uh, what province is it again? I'm thinking Nablus. But, no. Is it? I think it's Sinai, actually. The Sinai Desert, the Highlands. If, if, the, if the Ottomans own that, then they, they are eligible for the mission. Look it up if you want, but... I don't think the Ottomans even have claims. Oh, they do. When will these run out? Pretty soon, I suppose. Okay, what? Yeah, 1526, okay. So in another three years the claims will be gone. And he's, he already shifted his, uh, his vital territory. It says strategic utility now because he has claims. Basically the idea is that this move is really risky. Asking a territory next to the... To the... Uh, to the Ottomans. But as long as it isn't a militarist, he won't go crazy over it. You will get once your provinces modified from an administrator and whatnot. But it'll usually it will usually not be uh, higher than 150 for an for an administrator. And as long as you can keep your uh, opinion positive, they us they usually won't go hostile. I say usually. And if you then own a core here, they will reassign their vital territory, and then it's just a matter of getting 100 opinion again. You can keep him as an ally. It's risky, but uh, I've did this a couple of times already. Basically, it's a game of troll the Ottomans. But no, they won't get a mission for Egypt if they don't own Sinai. I'm pretty sure it's Sinai, but I, I'm not sure. Pretty sure they need province in this area. If it, if it's Nablus or Dera, yeah, they got conquered Levant mission. So, no, won't happen. Moment, my fort falls. He can have Cyprus. <laughs> look at the look at the Mamluks. Mamluks might not even exist after this. Only only here maybe. Um, peasants? Yeah, now it is born. <sighs> Oof. 
Luckily, my troops arrived there before the peasants spawned. And these, yeah. Bye, peasants. Is there anything else I need to worry about? And these guys? How can I even... Well... How many... Will you even spawn? No problem. 19k, yeah. I'll just keep on paying for my troops then, I guess. Where will they spawn? Jerba, Gafsa, Constantine. Oh yeah, that's 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 from the estates. So basically, wherever I uh, assign the estates, why are the nobles uprising? They don't. They aren't that low. Huh. Don't make me uh, revoke all your land. I don't know. Yeah, I got twenty war exhaustion again. Twenty. Call me mad. Ask for some manpower. But no. Reduce war exhaustion and they will go away. But I don't want to spend my uh, my points on it. I rather pay for like. Well, do I? I would need to uh, to get to get like uh, to do it like five times, and then I got ten years, so 120. Yeah, maybe I should do it because 20 war exhaustion won't go away and. Uh, Maybe I should lower it a bit. You're right. Yeah, I cannot even... 98 due to corruption, so I can do it like 3 times 6. Huh. That would get in the way of 6. Yeah, they would, they would still spawn. They would still spawn. Yeah. Constant... Gafsa, Constantine. What is even the biggest province? Jerba. Gafsa. Not in Egypt. Yeah, no. Seriously? Do I really worry about these stupid rebels? Oh, there it is. I'm so blind. I'll go there and see. I can end the war right now. As soon as this fort is fallen. Here we go. There's no reason why I shouldn't already get caught. So, Ottomans. You can have Cyprus and they will actually owe me nine favors now. So first they help me defeat Hejaz, Funj, Morocco, uh, everybody, Mamluks. Then I give them what they want and I, without doing a damn thing almost and <laughs> they get nine favors. I can call them into a war with favors now. Yeah, sure. Take it. Money. Is there any reason why not? No. Bye bye. That was the war. Yep. And it won't go below 100. It won't go below uh, 110. Yeah, I'll, I'll see where these uh, stupid nobles will spawn. Uh, we have gained. I have gained. Oh, yeah, that, that's for uh, that's from these problems. But that'll go away in two years. So who can I rival now? Still not, still not a Jazz or Spain. Oh well. Yeah. And uh, Ottomans is saying, Nah, we won't really you. Four more. Bah, this is still so da This is dangerously close. Aggressive expansion is killing me here. 
I need to chill out and I need to chill out now. The noble rebels, yeah. Will they even... I'm gonna keep my diplomat there and I, I do I need this if anything I should be uh, nah need this I could use it for uh, claiming the heck out of Morocco this is my claim that is my claim. it's about uh, it's also then So, is there anything else I can do to please the big Ottoman? Oh, send the gift? Nah. And I gave him access and I cannot... Do I even rival them? Portugal, probably? Yeah, why not? That's enough, you say? Okay. So, I got 94... Do I even have... Yeah, now I can embargo Portugal. Not that it's uh, of any use. But. And now it's just chill out time. But I don't think... Uh, I. Uh, yeah, I'm waiting until I can rival Spain so we share rivals. Car? Uh, no, nah, I don't want to rob a car. I cannot even do it. It was Venice or Hungary. And I don't need to rival them because the game is saying, yeah, you got enough rivals now. I want to wait now. Chill out. Uh, pay down my war exhaustion and then... Uh, yeah, but I'm losing a lot here just to keeping for keeping that overextension. Send pirate fleets to Sevilla. Yeah, I could do that, but what's the gain? Uh, they, yeah, I'm already at max uh, maximum power projection, and I don't want. I don't believe in trade fleets because, yeah, the moment you declare war on anybody that is in the Mediterranean, they will kill the fleet, or, or you gotta park it in a in a harbor. Is the oh Regency Council cannot have rule of trades? Okay. Well, yeah, they are pissed off. Obviously, I could get them out. Maybe call him. relations with you and with you why not I got my uh, a vassal here in uh, Hungary now have their independence guaranteed by the Ottomans okay oh and the Mamluks lost to the <laughs> Mercuria Oh, Alodia took something in my... Alodia took something in my state. This cannot stand. Who are you allied to? Nobody that, that it's really big, I want, I think. But yeah, do I even want to expand? Seriously, yeah, I need to take my war exhaustion down here. Ah, uh, Tunisian rebels. Is there any way... Oh, is that true, Dayton and Al? Oh, that's the knee. <laughs> Pirate fleets in Sevilla have a high chance of uh, intercepting treasure fleets. Okay. Yeah, and didn't I have that, uh, that modified that sh ships are cheaper? Yeah, maybe I should do it and expire in 6 November. The plan now is just to chill out for 10 years or longer and then start another war. Take my war exhaustion down, don't pay for my army, kill all my mercs and then uh, 
I need these guys out of my hair first. 2.4 years. Pfft, I won't. Pay, I will pay you as soon as they had 80 or so. Fleet maintenance, missionary maintenance, root out corruption. Yeah, I want to root it out. <laughs> it's at 30 again. But yeah, fleet. How much of a fleet can I build now? 34. Who would be in my hair if I privateer here? Yeah, Portugal and Morocco. Yeah, it isn't a bad idea. I would steal money from Morocco, from Portugal, from Spain. Yeah, sure. France might even like it. <laughs> what is the cost of one flimsy bark? Uh, what? what is 18? So uh, if I make, let's say, 30, it cost me... I'll make a few. I'll make a few. And if they are really successful, then... Uh, it's free power projection after. And that power projection will tick down over time. There we go. 15. Not bad. If I manage to steal over 100 ducats from a single treasure feed. Oh really? I didn't know that. I usually don't do achievements, I don't care, I, I just do it uh, in this stream. Because I figured people like watching achievement runs. Oh, this is the peace deal for, uh, yeah, Hungary took a bite out of uh, Bohemia. Ah. It took a bite. I'm using a mod by the way to make this more clear. Bohemia will annul all treaties with Poland. They lost three provinces. Oh, return cost to Saxony? Why would you do that, Hungary? Are you allied to Saxony or something? Nah, it's probably just to uh, weaken it. Well, this is uh, Austria and a PU under Hungary. Ah, I'm losing it again. Greater power status. Now you can you can go. Do I want to influence anybody? <laughs> it seems like a big waste of time. Nah. I don't care for advisors as long as I have corruption, so... Nah, I'm making a fraction of money. They will spawn. Oh, gain 70 ducats. Nice. He's giving me money. Ah, uh, wait a moment. Nah, I was wondering, are the Ottomans still, uh... Are the Ottomans still, um... Oh, I am paying for him. Uh, oh yeah, that, that's for the, uh... For this guy. Yeah, do I want him? <sighs> I'm not gonna declare war. I, I need, uh... Dosh, we need to build buildings. Not Monarch points. Go. Hi there, you ha Yeeha. Oh, I did have subsidies. Why wasn't it showing? Oh, I, I, okay, three subsidies. I was blind. I was looking at the red letters, not. Yeah. Okay. Now they say we won't subsidize you. Yeah, from now on, it's basically boring, boring, boring. The only thing I gotta do now, basically, is watch this here. If they go below 100 somehow, I need to act. I'm 
maybe I should keep a diplomat. How is Albania still alive? Oh, well, it's worth checking. Allied with Hungary. Yeah, Ottomans versus Hungary, Austria. Yeah. They seem to be moving troops over here, but that's probably because of the rebels. Yeah, another world. Ah, uh, we are no longer a greater power. Oh. So, I could call all of this, but nah. It's costing me like 55%. Do I really care? I can pay for it right now. But I could also tech up. And build some workshops, maybe that's a better idea. And just wait a bit to call all this and uh, pay for the... The only thing uh, that this means that... Uh, I'll pay for uh, corruption longer from the overextension. Workshops. Is that really worth it? Yeah, I got some... Uh, where is it? I got some cloth provinces, so I... Ah, yeah, and I got a iron here. Oh, and cloth here, yeah. I think I'm gonna invest in workshops then. Institution stack, yeah. Uh, colonialism. Colonialism, is that even spreading to me yet? Wait, what? I did embrace the Renaissance, right? <laughs> Don't tell me I, Yeah, I, I embraced it. No, nothing with colonialism. No, no colonialism in sight yet. Well, it's spreading. So, uh, I don't know. It'll spread to me eventually, I guess. Institutions, seriously. Yeah, I didn't. Too. Nah. Yeah, I'll go I'm gonna get that tech 6. Best in workshops. Oh, hi there, PP Volto. A new run. Yeah, this is a new run. Manipure is done. I got my achievement just by speed 5ing and fighting Bahmanis when they attack. I finished my Manipure achievement on 20 War Exhaust. No, no, not 20 War Exhaust. Minus 3 stability, 100 corruption, 0 legitimacy. Blah, blah. But I got it. That's what counts. Uh, so, workshops. I'm just wanna wanna see where where is what, where is it, where it's worth it. Huh? Yeah, it should be worth it here, right? In, in my capital. Oh well, not nowhere else is it really worth it. But it's. I'll build one in my capital and be done with it then. I was just waiting for the nobles. I actually wonder if they'll spawn. Probably. Yeah, should be paying for my troops again and kill these guys. Oh yeah, maybe I shouldn't have done it right now. <laughs> yeah, but I cannot cancel it. Damn it. Okay, I don't want to take a loan. Let's stop rooting out corruption a bit. <laughs> yeah, I sent my ruler on a... I don't get it. I sent my previous, previous ruler on a hatch. And now it says, yeah, it is over. But yeah, my, my, my ruler died during the hatch. Ah, uh, well. Ah, such nice... Aspectorica mod, such nice images. <laughs> yeah, PP Volto, I agree. You almost never see people 
stacking Karakspin even above 5, but I uh, I tend to use it. I tend to uh, go up to 50 corruption just to be able to debase my currency. And by using debased currency, I pay off loans usually. Basically, I want to be I want to be uh, expanding in the 15th century on loans and debasing, racking up corruption, and with the power base that I obtain, I pay off corruption. You need to get the money from somewhere and it's better to get it from debasing because that doesn't give inflation. I think. Does it? Doesn't say so here. So yeah, I could uh, go and privateer in uh, Sevilla. Sevilla and bind. Yeah, here. Yeah. Total change will be lost. What? Only in Alexandria I would get a change. This even right. Yeah, but I will get money from privateering, right? Oh well, but it's not worth it. It says I would have to. Uh, I would have to privateer in uh, the other trade notes. Was it again? Safi, it said. Yeah, this one. Then I would get it. Then I would get a profit. So... What do I get now from these? Uh, embargoing Portugal, sending privateers against Portugal, plus four. <laughs> Intercepting gold fleets. Doesn't that have like a really low chance? Well, yeah, it says this there is lost, but I would gain it if I send it to Safi. I want to dodge, really. I mean, what is the chance even to intercept a trade fleet with a, a, a gold fleet with 11 boats? I don't believe in it. So if I privateer Safi, I'll make a profit. And I want to make a profit with these guys. There we go. Hello Rebels, will you even spawn? It's based on the value of the fleet privateering, so yeah, you need, I think you need like a huge fleet. But you're saying that the, the fleet will always intercept the, and, uh, and I will get more ducats the bigger the, the privateer fleet is, that is what you're saying, right? But I, they don't even have a lot of... They got a colonial nation, okay. I don't know, man. I'm wondering, can I even... Oh. Um. <laughs> so you're privateering there. 44... Wait, what? Now oh, maybe I, I I'm just gonna test it out. 44 gain. I know the uh, the tooltips for the for this can be a little bit lying. So let's see. Private use of villa. It says here I'll make loss. So tell me. 38. Yeah, it's less. Why? But. Okay, if you say so, that. Uh...
You get a percentage, the random knack is saying you get a percentage of the trade fleet value based on your privateering strength. Only worthwhile if they have lots of colonial gold provinces. Yeah, that was my gut feeling also. It's not worth it. I should send them to uh, somewhere where they actually make money. <laughs> what is he even doing? Look at it. What is this trade fleet even doing? Oh, France entered, entered an alliance with the Ottomans. Okay, are you friendly to me then? No. But I, I want to improve relations with... Uh, if I can rival uh, Spain at some point. Ah, there they are. Ah, come on, do you have to spawn in bloody highlands? No way they can win it. Ooh. Trust. Come on. Oof. <laughs> Seriously? I almost lost versus those guys. Oh we go. It's worth it later in game if the tooltip is uh, is without that stack of ships added. What is what is he even doing here? Look at that fleet, it's going back and back and forth into port. Come on game. More corruption, great. Why are they all always going back and forth, back and forth, back and forth? They can reach Seville, all right. Again. <laughs> what are they even doing? Look at this. Oh, sorry. Oh, I got another boat. Join the team. Yeah, basically now uh, I'm actually uh, tempted to kill the stream here because you guys won't see anything worth watching in the next couple of years. So how long is this region? Six more years? Yeah, well, let's just speed five. If anybody has any questions or uh, wants to ask me something, go ahead. Oh, a jazz is under attack also? Oh, that's good. Yeah, maybe I can jump on them when my regency ends. Oh wait, what? The Council of Zurich? Man, I shouldn't have clicked it away. What is that? Council of Zurich? That's not the pro that's not the reformation event cycle throw. Nah. I've almost never seen it happen here. Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll max out. Did I set you as friendly? So I did. And they won't. Nah, they will never be. Just gonna keep one diplomat. I'm pretty sure the Ottomans. They do. They even have claims on me still. No. Hi there, Diab. How do you even pronounce it? How did the Manipur save go? Well, I finished it. I got it. Due to bandwidth problems, I couldn't stream uh, while I completed it. But yeah, I just speed. F I just just did speed five into the uh, into the 18th century. Uh, there's a chance. Blah. Appreciate the gesture. What do I even want here? Yeah, I'll take the <laughs> awful. Ah, uh, what was I saying? Yeah, I just did speed five. Bachmanis did, did uh, declared on uh, all of my allies and me 
thinking, yeah, our troops can defeat all of you because we have military tactics bonus. What I then did is micromanage a bit. Let all the stacks attach. Oh, Ottomans. Ah, oh, come on. You can still go for a Jaws. But not soon then. Basically, I uh, placed all of the Allied troops inside Bahmanis, and Bahmanis occupied them. And it was just a siege battle, and I won it. I occupied his capital, basically, and Tai Bachman has got all my cores back, all the land that I needed. And in the end, I had to uh, flesh out religious ideas for the missionary strength, just for the one religious center you need to convert from the sick. What is it again? The uh, This province, I think. Uh, which one? It's Sir Guya. I think this spawns a sick religious center at some point. And I needed to flesh out religious ideas. I needed to uh, make Jar Candy culture accepted. So I had to develop it to 20 development. And after that, using all the bonuses, I could convert everything I, ne I needed. <laughs> RDC, man. No. Look at my fleet. What are they even doing? They still give me spoils of war. But they aren't paying for themselves, so this tells me I shouldn't. Maybe make some cogs? That would be a good idea to ferry troops from here to there. Yeah, why would I? Still though, I need some cogs. Um, I don't know. Last 15 or so. 5, 6. I'm not gonna build a template. Just the good old fashioned way. 15 cocks. Thank you very much. And now it's basically speed fiving. Oh yeah, by the way. I don't know if this is not... If this is caused by the mod, the rippling water and the reflection and all. Yeah, the, wa the water is just so nice with uh With all the mods I use. If you want to know what graphic mods I use, the links are on my Twitch page. Below, if, if you go, uh... If you go, uh... And watch it in Windows. Subara. Yeah, where are my merchants? That's a good question. I should collect in, uh... I'm pushing trade to the Ottomans. Nah, that's... Uh, that's what I have totally forgot about my uh, about my merchants. Thank you for reminding me. I'm I'm only making one and a half ducat in trade, so it's not much. Is there anything else I should consider? When can I milk my estates again? Fifteen thirty-two. Yeah, that's not too far away. If I assign some more province to the merchants, didn't I assign this already? Yeah. So merchant girls have Alexandria priests. Totally forgot about all this, man. This is what. what, what. If I fight uh, a war, I tend to forgive about my management stuff. Ah. Uh, Grain, so I. Now, if I state all of this up, the nobles will ask for something also. Grain province, fish province. Yeah, I'll give this to the nobles then. Why not? Is that a. No, but it's already below. Jerusalem! Uh, 332. Yeah, but this is all so low, so low uh, autonomy already. It's not even worth it to assign estates. Anything else I forget? Uh, I don't need those advisors. Uh, strength in government? No. Accepted cultures? Yeah, that's a that's a good one. Maybe I should probably uh, make Egyptian culture accepted. 
or Algerian, but Algerian is in is in my uh, it's in my it's in my culture group now. So if anything, I should make uh, these guys. Yeah, I'll do it. Make me a lot more money in the end. <laughs> Tough luck, Andalusian, but I won't get you. Uh, There we go. I'm just gonna cycle. So, uh, what did we make now? 23. That'll go up. Because they are expert mode. No. Tech. No. No. Need it. Oh, I forgot about. Yeah, I forgot about this mission. Sod it. Let's see what we can take. You are lowering. You are under tech stability. Rebels. Wait, what? Are they there again? Seriously? <laughs> Why are those guys even spawning, I wonder? Oh, no forts active. I couldn't... I cannot even integrate a vassal because I, I don't have the coring range. What is the liberty desire of this guy? 34%? Seriously? I'll improve some... Uh, Relations with you then. And a marriage, why not? So, yeah, this is like speed fiving, rooting out corruption, and going yay ho. But yeah, and I, I wanna wait by tacking up military. Till I uh, increase all this. What does military tech then even give me? Unions. <sighs> Idiot. Does anybody know how, how fast does colonialism spread? I think it's a bad idea to uh, to develop for colonialism. And yeah, it's already spreading here. Over here also? That's the Mamluks. So, uh, how is the spread of colonialism even... Port capital owner blah blah, nearby friendly province, port neighboring province... Yeah, it'll spread eventually. I don't think... If I... Well, let's pay off all this uh, maybe I should start coring it because yeah now I'm paying for a heap of money from overextension I don't really need uh, well much more or less would it cost me now 360 425 oh, I cannot even do it now so wait Maybe I should lower it, but yeah, I bought it. Take away anyhow. How long? Are, oh, I lost all my claims here. Max out. Let's see if we need more spy networks again. Ah, oh, my cog's finished. Where's the cog? Yeah, and I don't even have a fort to park him in. Oh well. I don't think the Ottomans will ever go hostile again. They lost all their claims on me. Let's double check that. Yep. They lost all their claims on me and they don't see it as vital 
utility. Well, they do see it as vital utility. Uh, strategic utility, I mean. But yeah, they, they moved it into Hungary, Lithuania, Kara. Yeah, my gamble paid off, really. My gamble paid off. I, I get to court uh, Egypt for myself. And in the long run, it enables me to even go for... Uh, Oh, lose three. Oh, this is basically uh, one of the best events I can get now. I, I'll take the inflation for the war exhaustion. Bye, well, lucky. Is it true that not every nation can be formed by decision? I don't know, Tom. I never toyed around with uh, campaigns where you flip nations. I didn't even know Granada could form Tunis. If you full annex, basically what I I full annex Tunis, culture shifted to uh, Tunisian, and then it said, yeah, you can form Tunis now. But I usually don't base my campaigns on uh, flipping. I did it. Uh, I did form the the Mughals once, but nah, I, d I don't know. If you call to shift to Sicilian to form Sicily, I know you can uh, form Italy. Let's say if you call to shift to Italian, but there might be exceptions. Okay, this is important. What? Ooh, a militarist. That's not good. Yeah, I'm gonna recall you just in case. <laughs> Here's the hoping that he doesn't reshuffle all his vital interests. It seems like he doesn't. A new ruler can shift his vital interests. But he didn't. Oh, was it a militarist already in the Ottomans then? Probably. Yeah, it was a militarist because he he didn't flip out. Oh, what, what, what was I even worried about then? So, France, how about an alliance? No, you say. Improve the relations? Seriously? Is this because, uh, yeah, is it, isn't, is it now because I improve relations that they get some relations also? Cannot believe France is, uh, nah, they aren't improving relations with me. Nobody is. Yeah, but, but they might go. F they might go friendly at some point. Just wondering. Do I still got? Yeah, I still got it. I still got my access into car from ages ago. Silly. Ah, he doesn't change out his uh. Oh hi there, Jiglungs. It's working slightly. Ah, yeah, yeah, okay. Not talking to me. God, it's a whole load of nothing going on. But yeah, in theory, I can sit on on these. It's actually funny that uh, I accepted this culture now. Ooh, I I, I got him again. Huh. Uh, I don't want these rebels again. Please. I want separatism to be... Oh, it's everywhere, you say. <laughs> yeah, everything that the rebels occupy. Oh, well. More rebels. Do I care... The Ottomans can kill him, but at some point I want to get rid of the, uh... I could go and fight him myself, but how many are there? 36k, thank you, not... Nah, I can just sit on it, I suppose. How long? 
No. Should I? I could start a war in like two years. Uh, the 5th, 23rd of May. Uh, next year even. Uh, but I cannot declare on a jazz. When is your truce up? Oh, I don't have a truce with you anymore. Yeah, I could stomp. I, I could go and stomp Morocco. Morocco. Yeah. They got. They got a lot of troops also. Thirty-seven thousands. Is that worth it? I can go for Morocco. I don't even. Cool. Well, I can match them in force limit, but yeah. If anything, I want to pay down this here and just chill out. Oh, well. Is there anybody? Should I go for the... Moroccans? Nah. If anything, I want to wait until uh, the Iberians go for them. Then come knocking. So who has claims on Morocco? Oh, on what? Spain doesn't have claims, but Portugal does. Yeah, Portugal could actually declare on uh, Morocco. With the help of Spain. Do they see it as vital blah blah? Yes they do, so it might happen. Might happen. Yeah, I know Jake Lones Harbor rulers. I, I disinherited a guy with 064 because I wanted an heir with a with good administrative, but yeah, I got I got this guy in, in place of a 064. So actually I lost uh oh well. Oh yeah. Now I can mullock the estates again, so I should look So call a diet. Who is this? The Lima and the Merchant Guild. Can I get 75? Yes, I can. Oh, why not? Hey, let's hope for a good general. 150 military. Yes, please. Oh, manpower. I'm already at maximum. Maybe I should raise an army. So my manpower isn't maxed out anymore. Probably should have done that ages ago, but... Oh. Merchant Guild loses loyalty. Yeah, I, I can get... Yeah, I'll, I'll do you. I can give them gold. There's no way. Actually, if I give one province... And loyalty. Ducats or diplomat? Yeah, this will I'll ask the contribution. Uh, can I get into 75 here? Uh, 65. Yeah, wait. This is 10. This is 10. Yeah, I can get into 75. Is it worth it? No, not worth it. Because I will gain 20% in 37. Then it's uh, 100, make a donation, and seek support. Everybody happy. What do I even have here? So in case uh, they declare, I'm gonna place my, uh, my army there. Yeah, my plan is now to chill out. Simply uh, make troops. Oh, Commonwealth formed. Okay, I Commonwealth. Please don't attack my buddy. <laughs> they are allied to Hungary. No, they are not. Luckily for me, yeah, but they might. If if Commonwealth eclipses Hungary somehow, I'm not even sure. It, are PU subjects counted? Or eclipsing. I don't know, we'll see. But if the Commonwealth ally Hungary, then, then the, uh, the Ottomans might be in trouble. 
If they go and fight amongst themselves, the Ottomans will rush in and, act, and annex Hungary. Hi there, rock cooks. I am new to Europa. Universalis 4. Where can I read some prop guides about this game? Uh, you could go to the wiki and read all the basic articles. That's actually quite a good idea. Just Google EU4 wiki and you will see it. Read all the basic articles about economy, uh, land warfare, uh, and stuff like that. Estates, phew, political stuff, how tech groups work, how tech levels work. Read all that. And then there, you, you should watch, I think uh, you should watch some U some YouTube guides. Oh, wait a moment, guys. I gotta, I gotta take this. Excuse me for a second. Ah, oh, sorry about that. I'm on call. I gotta accept those uh, phone calls. Ah, uh, what I was even saying. Yeah, you should watch some uh, YouTube guides, maybe. It all depends on what you wa you want information from. If you want information on, let's say, how to w wage wars, you can watch a, a YouTube channel, a YouTube video. But nation management is basically, in general, the hardest to learn. Because there's so many DLC now. Oh well. Just read on the, the wiki, uh, look up some YouTube uh, videos and watch that. Jake Lone just trying Mario Nostrum on my very first hard campaign. Ah, very hard is, uh, well, very hard. Very hard is very hard. I hope it turns good for you. I managed to, uh, this is very hard by the way for uh, anybody who doesn't know it. I, I stomped, I full annexed Tonnes on very hard. So yeah. I like to be, uh, I like to think that I'm pretty good at this game, but I won't brag about anything. Nah, I cannot, oh. I oh, know. I thought this was Annex Fossil, but it's Designate March. I don't want them as a March. Oh uh, well. So I was considering attacking who again? Marco. I don't want, how long are these claims? Fifteen forty-nine. Yeah, I used to. I don't want to go versus Morocco on my own. It doesn't sound like it's worth it. I want to chill out, pay off, and. Uh, yeah, be at peace for like five more years at least. Seriously, game. <clears throat> if I say corruption events spawn more in uh, in sunny nations, <clears throat> oh, it's not true, by the way. But could think it. Oh well, my targets. At least I get a nice image if corruption event about the Ars Pictorica mod. I can link it for anybody uh, from my Dropbox for anybody that uh, wants it. But basically, it, it changes all the event pictures into these nice, and it's all dependent on culture and region. You will get different pictures. If you play a Native American, you'll see Indians. If you play a North African, you'll see this or. If you play an Eastern tech group, you will get yeah, uh, Cossacks and stuff. Yeah. But was I, wasn't I going to make a spy network on anybody? Uh, oh yeah, I had Jaws. But I would have to wait until I call the Ottomans in versus... Uh, it's worth checking. Will the Ottomans actually help me? Yeah, I 
I cannot check it because, because I'm in a Regency. Seriously, game? I hate this. I hate building spy networks for claims and stuff. If anything, I would want, hey, I want to fabricate a claim here and that a diplomat gets sent automatically, make a spy network until I get 20 and then we call the guy automatically, like it was before they installed spy networks. Oh, they say, you gotta micromanage more. You gotta micromanage more for not. Okay, here's the hoping that the air that I get is actually a bit good. These orange Jesus. 433. Oh well. I'll take him. So I got a Muhammad with an air Muhammad. <laughs> okay. Now why isn't he the 13th then? If this guy is Muhammad the 12th, why isn't he the 13th? Ah. Who cares? Oh, but this is good. This is really good, if I had any provinces to convert, which I don't. Uh, yeah, I'll take this one. More exhaustion, less than one. And manpower recovery speed. Now, do I want a diplomatic reputation? Not my common handy. So... Did I eclipse him? Oh, now it says I, I, I got too few rivals. Well, I probably missed that for them. Who do I even rival? I don't want to be in the hair of France. So I cannot ally. I cannot rival Florence, Milan or the Papal State. Doesn't leave me m many options. Venice. Yeah, I could rival Venice. Hungary. Persia, huh, there's an idea, Persia is allied with Oman, ah, if Ottomans eat Kara, ah, Persia, why not, they won't invade me, but wait a moment, if I choose Venice and issue an embargo, maybe Venice is the better choice, I don't see the Ottomans of France. Yeah, well, if France allies Venice, nah, I'll take Persia just to be safe. And there you go, Persia. You are a rotten fish. I still keep this pop-ups alive just to see what is it, what wars and you know, all break out. Otherwise, I might miss a war. From Portugal against Spain. So, am I again at max force limit? Uh, wait, what? My maximum manpower drop. Why did it drop? Huh. I'm pretty sure it was 33k maximum before. <laughs> this is weird. Well, uh, so, one, two, three, four, five, three, bam, well, six, seven, there we go, and at least I got an army. Oh, in, in comes uh, the Ottomans allying Persia. Uh, I should have checked that one first. Oh, neutral. Oh, the Persian attitude toward the Ottomans is friendly, damn it. Could have picked Venice, but yeah, if France then. Uh, mind. The Ottomans will likely not ally Persia. Plus, they got shared rifles, yes, they do. Fine. Oh yeah, the Ottomans, I don't even know how it works. If I rival this guy, will the Ottomans get minus to 50, minus 50 to getting an alliance because uh, allied to uh, a rival, blah, blah. Now, Persia would have to rival me back, I think, before he has any uh, consequence.
Oh yeah, Mamluks. My truce with the Mamluks ends. Okay, I could go and fight these guys. If anything, I should be making a uh, spy network in the Mamluks. That's what I was thinking about and which I forgot. I don't, do, I, do, do I even have a claim in, in you? Oh, I do. Okay. I don't need a spy network. Yeah. Mamluks is calling out to me now. Uh, I'll go and uh, kill the Mamluks. So, uh, Mr. Boatman! Yeah, Pike Emperor, that's what I... Uh, I agree, the AI cheats sometimes when getting in lines. The AI cheats in many ways. 15, ah, oh, come on! No friendly transports? Ah, oh, you gotta be kidding me, I made galleys instead of cogs! <laughs> Seriously? Ah, oh, come on! Why didn't anybody point that out? I made galleys instead of cogs. Great! But yeah, I don't even need to move. Uh, I don't even need to move into there. I can just march on here and go. But still, though. Well, do the Mamluks even have boats yet? Still. I made galleys and Yeah, okay, galleys I can use them, I suppose. They don't cost me uh, anything in upkeep almost. Yeah, they got 14 light ships, so I might actually sing those suckers. So, galleys, make yourself useful. Um, why not maybe even ask an admiral? Can I do that? I, wanna, I can do it if I assign any province to the merchants. Oh, hi, Tom. Yeah, I, I uh, downloaded the mods that add, uh, that add Paradox music to the music player. Just to, see, to add some variety to the, to the music. Yeah, the merchants will take this. Why not? Then I can ask for a, for a nice free admiral. Oh, I. Right. Right. The worst general then. Yeah. You can download uh, the uh, music mods from uh, the Steam Workshop, and then you get the music from Vicky too, from uh, Hearts of Iron 4. Europa Universalis 3 and whatnot. 2 2, yeah, that's not bad. Yeah, make yourself useful, golly. I should do it now before. Uh... There we go. I, can, I should do it now and declare while uh, his fleet. Can I even uh, blockade anything? They, they don't have a fort. It's like only this, that. But yeah, but thing is, I gotta, I gotta start coring him then and finish it before I fully, fully annex him. So how's my war exhaustion doing? Yeah, I, I must declare on the Mamluks now before, uh, before I lower it. Start the coring. Oh, wait a moment. Yeah, no, 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 no. I cannot core it because uh, I cannot do that. Damn it. Because I'll be at war with the Mamluks and it'll just halt. But yeah, how much would this even be? It's like 9, 4, 3, 3, 3, 3. Yeah, it's, it's gonna be more than. Oh, well, I'll hit them anyway. And I'm probably jinxing myself here. I should wait here and uh, declare before they get another alliance. Yeah. 
Why not? They got like 9k troops. And the Ottomans don't even want to buy. Nah, he's gonna go to my... Oh, uh, how what about this Mamlukian separatists? Ah, that, those are concerned. Oh, if you uh, go there... Then I'll keep on traveling. Oh, France is gunning down Great Britain. You. Bring in on the fort. Another mercantilism event. Okay. You going for the fort? Probably. For you? Nah, he's probably gonna go here. Let's go to Alexandria, see from there. I did have a truce with the other. Yeah, now, now he's twitching. I could split up and then. But I, I wanna wipe this guy out first. Inya. But another one? That's weird. Oh, how much? 1609. Kina. Just to show that somebody go there. See from there. Can he even do? Can I one? He's so what? He's surrounded by. Oh, don't speed five. So, oh, he's moving locked. Okay then, I'll join. Kara declared on Persia. Man have dishonored their alliance. Okay, so something is stirring in. Uh, Something seems to be stirring, and it's probably all because of the wars I started. Problem is, these separatists they can over they can uh, stop pouring this land, but if anything, they'll spawn in career. It's everything. What is he even? Oh, they do have a. Oh, yeah, capital fort. <laughs> Silly me. Go and siege the capital then. And you can have the, uh, the artillery helping out. One artillery regiment on a capital fort means plus one <laughs> to siege rolls. That's, uh, that's worth it on itself. Where are they even gonna run to? Two, three, no, that's enough. Didn't make a fort here, did it? No. Fort. There's one big uh, advantage of these wastelands, <laughs> yeah, they cannot run anywhere. Unless they go... Wait, what? They are going... Ah, oh, come on. They are running into West Africa. Are you kidding me? Silly game. <laughs> they are running into us. Good. Even 
point. <laughs> he's gonna he's gonna run all the way over here, isn't he? Yeah. <laughs> and he got the, he has a three maneuver guy, so I cannot outrun him. So yeah, I could do like this, full annex him and then say, yeah, Mr. Rebels, come on over, come back, and I'll await you here. Do I even bother? Oh, well, why not? Can I, oh, cannot imagine the AI would be... Silly enough. Do I plan to move into West Africa? I don't know. I might. Okay. Catch him. Oh. Yeah, that's what you get when doing wars on speed 5. I'm pausing for a second. Ah, oh, come on! There he goes again. <laughs> Please remind me not to do wars on speed 5 next time. Oh, this is it. Got about this one. Could make troops there, go for a bit. Yeah, Mr. General. <laughs> We're all hit when losing a ship minus 10%. That sounds like super useful. Let's mud ball my fleet. I mean, what, what's even the use? Can I do anything with these guys? I'm pirates. Uh, are there even pirates in my trade jump? Oh. Go oh, mob ball. Oh, that's sad. What do they even cost me, I wonder? Well. Bit. Yeah, now, now they are going for my... I'm gonna lose a, gonna lose a guy simply for speed fiving this war. Oh man, and they, they are going to their capital, aren't they? Man, speed fiving war. Ah, I'll go there. Make some more troops, I guess. 8k guys, how many do I have here? 5, 7. Should do. Oh, he's moving back. Okay, sure. Okay. What are they even gonna... They're moving into uh... oh. a... <laughs> huh. Okay. Let's chase you. Probably won't catch him still. I make three. Oh. <laughs> there goes the AI suiciding the cell. So let's let's say uh let's take our time and watch Mr. Mamluks die. It's probably the last fight I'll ever do versus the Mamluks. Because they will turn into rebels after this. You tried Mamluks resisting at Wixen uh, his Granada into Tunis, but yeah, it's all futile. You die in the end. So it's Muhammad versus... <laughs> yeah, there goes his capital. This must be a set it. It's not a set it retreat. What? Oh yeah, this province. Pursue him. Wait, what? 
I'm there faster than him. How is that even? I had because they attacked me. Uh, that's funny. I'll arrive there first. Will I? <laughs> I do. I arrive. I. I've never out routed somebody. This is funny. I <laughs> I routed them and I arrive at their routing destination before they can even reach it. Okay. They probably attacked me when I was close to going to the next province. Then. Still though, that's hilarious. So bye. You tried. You got no troops anymore. You tried so hard resisting Granada. But it's all for you. So. What do I even want? Probably these three. Worth noting how many uh, for extension? 74. Okay. 74, so I can take 26. Yeah. Sharkia so is 12. Sharkia. So Sharkia. So You're only 12. 22. And then I probably want these two also. 24, that looks good. Only Makuria can attack him then. And I don't have to use uh, cogs even to reach this. So yeah, why not? <sighs> cannot give it to a vassal. I cannot really... Nah. I could go about... I say, hey, full annex you, but... Why would I? What the... Libyan Desert is 10. 13. Upper Egypt. Oh. 26 will do. Well, 24, I mean. Shall we? You are allied to Funge and. Korea. And I'm just wondering, Makuri oh, they don't have any allies. They don't have any allies, you say. So what if I do this then? 28, 19. That's too much. Ah, uh, I don't even need this. This then? Not enough. Ah. Uh, Sinai, see, come on, yeah, I can do this, fabricate on uh, my courier, why not, easy targets for the win, and I could actually uh, revoke all his cores, and make the uh, the Ottomans happy, I mean, I don't, I don't need to, uh, to engage him anytime soon, By revoking his scores, he loses a couple of provinces where uh, rebels. Well, actually, is this worth it? I should do it in the last peace deal, really. I'll do one. Then the the Ottomans again. Uh, they get a uh, an opinion bonus with me. Yeah, why not? This looks okay. Twenty-four. Let's double check. It was how much? 74, yeah, I can take 26, so yeah, I can do. No problem. So, it wasn't the last fight versus the Ottomans. But yeah. <laughs> they got like, what, three provinces? Poor Ottomans. Ah, poor uh, Mamluks, I mean. Won't have my claim immediately, so these separatists likely spawn before I can finish my claim. I don't want to get cornered here. Egyptians. Can I even run that? Has no interest. 
these two. Oh, I'll take. That's one. I'm out of here. That's uh. Not pay for the well, yeah, for the rebels maybe. But thing is, the Ottomans uh, they won't come. Ah, do I even need this fort? The rebels, if they occupy something, they, the Ottomans will only engage them. I don't even need this fort. I don't believe in forts. Never, never have, never will be. The rebels do whatever you want. Yeah, it's the Ottomans' problem, really. And let's. Uh, it still says that Mercuria. That Mercurian attitude towards Tunis and. Don't tell me they don't know about me, that's silly. Province limit here, 21. Why are you even still here, you stupid vassal? Go home. Yep, I can do that. So, yeah, and my manpower won't. So, uh, but yeah, I'm about that military power. I'm gonna do one check. Uh, of my nation again and then end the stream folks I got an, uh, another appointment today so I I gotta stop now but yeah we wanna we basically uh, stomp the mamluks into the ground so I'm happy I'm happy and we border them ottomans and they will kill our rebels and making the spy networks that I need yeah do I even need it? I won't be able to go for Mecca anytime soon. So... No. Ooh. Oh. What do I want to focus on, I wonder? Admin? Yeah, probably admin. Oh. 22, yeah, it's raising. Simply because they're good out. Yep. Good. Don't pay for the army. Stay. Yep. No. Yeah, I gotta do it. Or do I want to develop for colonialism? Can I play with Ottomans, please? Dancing the. You mean Danse de Panda in Dutch? Danse den Panda. And that's probably the Dutch. Ah, uh, no, the Ottomans is too easy for me, sorry. Sorry to disappoint you there, but uh, I won't do it. So, I'm actually wondering now how fast will Colonia. Oh, it's spreading already. Yeah, I think I will simply uh, take the tech penalty. I'll wait until it spreads some more. I mean, developing, if anything, I should develop for the printing press, right? Not colonialism. Printing press will, will spread a lot slower. There we go. Getting colonialism seems good. Yeah, that was, uh, that's what that was I was thinking also. It's already spreading in one of my provinces here. Well, I'll get it sooner or later. Shamshir. Oh, it's too dead, I got. And um, Pedrero will call it. Pedrero. Anything else? Idea groups? No. I got. Yeah, actually. Huh. If I flesh out uh, admin ideas, I get less. I get even more co creation costs. But yeah, I could take another one. I could do this. Seven wide right for the second, yeah. And then take, uh, I don't know, religious <laughs> to go into here. Oh, 
Uh, this is all Coptic. I could go Holy War this area. Heck, I could even use it for the fetishist. It's only uh, Adjuran over here. Couple of nations. Yeah, why not Holy War? Okay, so uh, I might do that then. Two silver extension that will finish from itself. This will also. F I did start coring everything. Yeah, I still don't have any medic. Yep, good. Okay, so yeah, folks. Uh, I gotta go. I gotta. I got an appointment. I hope you liked what you saw today. Uh, if you wanna see how I uh, stumped uh, the Mamluks, I basically uh, off stream. I bankrupted them. I uh, baited the. Uh, I promised Cyprus land at the start of the stream. I know, I promised Ottoman Cyprus at the start of the stream. They were allied to Mamluks. I made Mamluks go belligerent. This dragged Hejaz and Morocco in. And uh, yeah, well, the Ottomans basically won versus everybody. And I gave them this land, Cyprus. So everybody happy. And now the Mamluks, yeah, they are nothing anymore. So Tunis is expanding. We might even we might, we have our opening now into India, so to speak. We have a we have a core in uh, in the Red Sea soon, so we can uh, let's say Ottomans say, "Hey Ottomans, I want you to declare on Spain with me using favors, and then attack Hejaz while they are at it." We'll do that. We'll see about it tomorrow. So thank you for watching. I am Atwix. This is the Granada very hard into Tunis. Re reconquista achievement. I'll see you folks tomorrow. Thanks for watching. If you like my mods, if you like what you saw here, uh, feel free to follow me on Twitch or look at my Twitch page. Uh, all the links for the mods and uh, even for one of my after action reports is right there. So thanks for watching. Cheerio.